All right, make sure Persona 4. Oh, my ears. <laughs> that is so loud. I'm going to have to, on my side, do that. <laughs> that is so goddamn loud. There we go. <laughs> oh, that's pretty loud on my side. All right, let's see. Persona 4, the golden. We're doing it. We're back. Um, let's just get into the game, see how the audio is doing. Pay no mind to those, to those save files, because we're on this one. Hey, Breezy, how's it going? Uh, da, 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 da. Sorry. I like Persona. I like music. Alright, audio seems to be doing fine. Maybe I can kick it up a little bit. Uh, it's on 28 right now, so I'll kick it up to... I'll kick it up to 26. We're deadly. We're doing it. Oh, where'd my cursor go? There you go. I said I'm the one who's got the name. Said nobody. All right. <laughs> I listen to this on my spare time sometimes, and one of the things I really like is like if you listen closely, you hear the you hear like the little ball drop in the background. Like listen to it. There you go. It's like someone's taking like a ping pong ball and they're just dropping it on like a wooden surface, and you just hear that like reverberating. I like it. It's good. All right. Just passed driving test today. Holy shit! I need to do that. <laughs> I need to. Hey, listen. I've been driving a car without a license. It's a bad thing. You shouldn't do it. <laughs> yes, officer. That guy. Um. Yeah. Fucking. I remember I went for a driver's test and then I got like this old ass fuck crutchety lady. Who just constantly spat in my face, and since I wear glasses, made it worse. And then put her fucking hands on the, uh, on the stick shift while I was driving. And when she did that, she's like, you're not done yet. And I'm like, what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> I cursed that lady out. I was like, uh-uh, nah, fail me, go ahead. Fuck it. I'll drive around without a license for a couple of years. I won't get caught. It's a bad thing, you shouldn't do it. I own a car and everything. <laughs> I own a fucking car with that license. Uh, I should do that. All right. <laughs> Fuck the law. This guy's a renegade. Um. So what the hell are we doing? Yeah, we're back. More Persona Four Golden, where we left off. What did we do when we left off? Can I bring up the log? No, I can't. Fuck. Um. Oh no, when we left off, uh, Chie, Chie fucking rushed ahead of us. Coconut head ass rushed ahead of us and got her ass handed to her by herself. How'd that even happen? How's that possible? I don't know. But, um, yeah, me and Yosuke hopped in, saved the day, like the big boys we are. And then, uh, we're going back to go get Yukiko. That's pretty much it. Yeah, that's what happened. Let's move on with our lives. Uh, it's gonna tell me I'm too tired, right? And where do you think you're going? To the strip club? Listen, I only said this once, so listen closely. Maybe it's normal for kids like you to be goofing around outside at night back in this big city. No, it's not. No, it's not. The city's super dangerous at night. But this isn't the city. It's the countryside. And your mother trusts me to keep you safe. You're not a kid anymore. I just have to trust you when you're out of my sight. But I can't just let you run around at night, you get me? So that's it. Don't go wandering around at night if you don't have any reason to go out at all, alright? Pulling a good old, uh, Link to the past. Fucking, Link, I told you not to leave the house. <laughs> alright, uh, let's see. Nothing catches your eye. Sorry about that. I killed the mood, didn't I? Hey, you fucking asshole. <laughs> Hi, Nanako. Don't fight. Sorry. No fighting. Fighting bad. Guess I'll just go upstairs and go to sleep. Huh? You can hear Nanako calling you from downstairs. The phone. 
the phone is ringing. <laughs> Dojima believes in the Hashling and Slasher. I believe it. Dojima does actually- Mmm. You're getting on to something there. <laughs> He's like, don't go outside. You don't want to meet any wandering cars about. That hit too hard. That's a deep cut. <laughs> it's me, Moroka. I have something I prepared for you. That you prepared for me. I was gonna say, is it that fine ass? But then I looked at Moroka and I said, no, it's not. It's not. That ass ain't fine. I was gonna deliver it to your house, but the situation's changed. I need you to come back. Uh, come, come pick it up. I'm in front of the gas station at the shopping district. You got that? Now hurry and come and pick it up. Well, I got a reason to go out, Dojima. Moroka has summoned you. Jesus. Who called you just now? Some fucking girl? <laughs> Don't tell me you're planning on going out at this hour. It's my homeroom teacher. He needs me. Your homeroom teacher wants to see you. You just transferred here and you already done something? Jesus, fuck. No, this is you we're talking about here. Well, I understand. Go take care of business and hurry back on home. In what world does a fucking teacher call you out at night and says, Yo, we gotta meet up. And then the fucking FBI doesn't just chase his ass. <laughs> like, for real. At night. I wish my fucking teachers called me at night. Some of them were pretty hot. I remember on, like, one of our, uh, off days or whatever at school where we were just goofing around fucking teacher was like all right who's playing spit with me tuck out the cards and i was like jesus fuck <laughs> we're doing this huh oh you're here sooner than i expected this is the school jersey i got it for you go on take it take it you'll get a bunch of different costumes and you can wear them and look pretty you put them on through your equipment it was great now that you got it get the hell out of here i need to see this girl home Yes. Yes, FBI. This man right here. The one with the buck teeth. <laughs> the one with the fucking narwhal incisors. You know the way to your own house, don't you? No, I don't. I just moved here. I'm right. I have no point. I have no reason to go in there. Uh, nighttime life. There's a lot we can do, and by a lot, I mean a very not that much, actually. Very limited things that we can do. Uh, one of the things I think I need to do, though, is I need to grab, just grab some sodas. Wait, what? It's a real game, however, all drinks have been sold out. Fuck, it's nighttime, you can't buy sodas. Jesus. Damn it. <laughs> I gotta buy some sodas. There's a lot of things I gotta prep in uh, Persona 4 Golden. Like, while I'm playing this, uh, while I'm doing this playthrough here, on the streams, in the background, I'm doing a New Game Plus playthrough. So that when we get to a certain point, we can just switch to that. Just to kind of have a little, a little closure, right? So right now, just gonna head on back home. You finish your business, return home? Yes. Like a cat. It's like a cat at night. You let it outside, it walks around the neighborhood, and it comes back, it's like, you finish your business, you wanna go home? Yeah, I guess. You're home, so what was it? Huh? You were given a school jersey, that's it? You could've just given to you at school. Well, I'm sure telling you this isn't helping. School's tough enough as it is. With these incidents going around, everyone's on edge. Yep, that is everybody's favorite wrestler. You're tired from, from everything that happened today. You should return to your home. Return to your home, my bad. Return to your room. You're inside your house and you're like, this isn't my home yet. And then you walk in your room, you're like, yes, I'm home. I wonder how she is doing. Too much stuff happened yesterday. I hope she's back to her usual self. Oh, morning. How's it going, Super Warrior? Morning. Yep. Uh huh. Just like that. <laughs> um. Thanks for everything yesterday. No problem. It's kind of embarrassing, you know? Yeah, that you think your best friend is beneath you? <laughs> and you whip her constantly? You two were right there to see my hidden 
feelings and all. That's why she was trying to whore her out the moment we met her. She's like, so you want to fuck Yukiko, right? Like, what? Don't sweat it. The same thing happened to Yosuke, right? Oh, yeah, he's pathetic. He was crying over a dead girl that didn't even like him. So, what was it like? And she had about, like, a 300 by 400 head. Huh? Uh, how should I put this? Oh, I nearly forgot. None of that happened when yours awakened, huh? Hmm. Could that be because you've got nothing to hide? Because I'm big dicking out here. That's what I'm doing. Oh, so nothing happened for you? Uh-uh, nothing. I gotta agree that you seem like a pretty open guy. There's a funny air about you. You saying I like dudes? I don't know. I guess that's what draws people to you or something like that. Falling for me? Unfortunately, you do not have enough courage to actually say that, you little bitch. I don't know. I guess that's what draws people to you or something like that. Yeah, I guess I'm cool that way. Want me to bear it all? What? Hey, whoa, what are you talking about? Don't do it. You'll get arrested again. <laughs> She's not legal. Anyways, what's most important right now is to rescue Yukiko. I'm dead set on coming. Remember, you promised. Jesus, you sound like my ex-girlfriend. I still haven't gone to the bathroom. What the fuck is wrong with you, Yosuke? Hey, um... Thanks for saving me. Yeah, no problem. Yosuke's cool and all, but... There really is something different about you. Yosuke's you cool and all, but he's a loser. <laughs> You sense Chie's gratitude to you. You feel a faint bond born between you. It's very faint, but you hear it. You feel hey me 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 me. Yosuke's looking out for me. Of course he is. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the Chariot Arcana. You have established the Chie Santanaka social link of the Chariot Arcana. You may earn an EXP bonus when fusing personas of the Chariot Arcana. Chie's determination in battle has been enhanced. Chie can now wake up a knockdown ally during battle. Man, you think Yosuke's looking out for me, but he's not. Yosuke went, listen, nobody's getting some unless I'm getting some. So he's super cock blocking it. <laughs> Safeguard. Ugh. You haven't asked Chie for her number yet. Ask her straight out. Unfortunately, you're such a little bitch, boy, you can't do that. Alright, say it's for the investigation. Jesus. Oh, Can I have your number? It's for the investigation. Huh? Yeah, it's kind of necessary. You exchange cell numbers. In the most bitch-made way. We have to be careful of the fog that sets in after the rain, right? Let's save her before that happens. After the rain continues for a while, it may become foggy. You must train yourself as much as possible until then. You should go to the Junes food court on the day that you want to explore the other world. You train yourself by gorging yourself on the fucking McDonald's dollar menu. After a prolonged period of rain, you may become fucked. You just said that. The game will end if you fucked up. People will die. The end. There's only one time in Persona 4 where I fucked up and didn't pay attention to the schedule. And then I answered the phone and I heard someone screaming and I was like, oh, that's really bad actually Hello, and good morning all my name is mr. Kondo your PE teacher if we're having a PE class Why the fuck are you inside homeroom? But since no one's school teaches English. I'm oh, okay. He's also our English teacher Don't be so disappointed. In fact, I spent some time overseas one week of vacation time to be exact. Oh, you're a bitch. But that's more than enough to teach a class. <laughs> we'll start with the basics for uh, English. The alphabet. It starts with the letter A, then B, then C, then 23 more. Maybe that was a little too basic, huh? Alright, I'll give you an alphabet related pop quiz then. Let's see. Not a commie. Yes, sir. The word alphabet comes from the word alpha. What's the other one? Beta. Like you. 
<laughs> beta made male. Good, that's correct. And he starts crying. He's like, my ex-wife called me a beta. <laughs> it comes from the first two letters of the Greek alphabet, alpha and beta. By the way, any set of the Western European character of uh, characters in a specific order is called an alphabet. In Japan, we say alphabet. We're talking about the English alphabet, but it doesn't always mean the English one. What? <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Hey, when we're talking about alphabet, we mean the English alphabet, but it doesn't always mean the English one. The fuck does that mean? Fog will come after several days. Alright. So. Okay, I get it. Damn it. Alright. So, you have a little voice icon up there. You can press the start button at any time. Is it the start button? We'll display five more. Okay, my bad. I say start button. I'm playing this on PC, but it has PS4 controller support, so I'm using that. So, I'm going off the PS4 controls. So, you press the touch button at any time, and then you'll acquire data from online, giving you some hints on what you can do for the day, what other people did, right? Some people went to TV, some people hung out with Mary, some people went to the library. Those people are bitch made. Alright. So when it comes to Persona 4 Gold, then I play it a very certain way. I either instantly go for uh, the dungeon to save the person, right? Or I wait till we have a super clear ass day where there's literally nothing for me to do. And our best interest is to hop into the TV world so that we don't waste any time. Now, we're playing this on a basic ass new game, not New Game Plus. So, there's no way we're going to be maxing out social links or nothing like that. Because I kind of want to show the game off in a fresh state, right? Um, Let's see. Should be nothing for me here in the, uh, in the whatchamacallit. Practice was called it's called practice uh floor it's called practice building there you go so yosuke chie don't want to hang out and that's usually normal when um when you have someone in a tv most of the uh most of the investigation team that you're with your party they actually don't really want to hang out that much because they just want to get that shit done then they want to hang out all the fucking time but the people in the school building always want to hang out most of the time, except for rainy days, except for the exception of maybe like two characters. Uh, let's see. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think right now. I always sit here on these fucking menus. Nothing for us to do at the Central Shopping District yet. So, we have a completely free day. We're going to head into the TV world. That's what we're going to do. We're going to save Yukiko. I like to do it in one shot. It seems as you can go to the food court from here, call your friends. Alright, we're all here. Think focus more on S links than dungeon grinding each day. Uh might switch it up. Oh, don't worry. If it's your first playthrough of um Persona 4. Uh well, of any Persona game really. Besides like one and two, I get no. Alright, let me let me restart that. Mainline Persona games 3 and up with social links. If it's your first playthrough with those, then, you know, you're not going to be able to max them out until New Game Plus. There's no fucking way you're doing it on a... on a, whatchamacallit, on a regular game, on your first new game, because you also got to get your character stats up. Uh, Jesus. Alright, so we're going to hop into TV. Alright, let's brace ourselves. Yes, let's, let's brace ourselves. Now, like I said, the way I do this is the same way I do it in Persona 3, same way I do it in Persona 4, same way I do it in Persona 5. I do it in one shot, because I don't want to waste a fucking day. <laughs> hey there, let's play, huh? No time? Oh yeah, that's right. Let's go save the lost girl. I'll take you to the castle. Alright. So, I'm going to have to be, I'm going to play this really carefully. <laughs> Welcome to the Velvet Room. Well then, shall I tell you about how I can offer my assistance? I can gather a number of personas you possess and provide you with the ability to fuse them. I have suggestions for the creations of powerful personas that may be of use to you. If you want to summon a new persona that you have not registered, please 
try the summon persona option. However, if you registered a persona in the compendium, you will be able to summon that persona by selecting check compendium. If you wish to know more about the compendium, please ask my bottom bitch, Margaret. <laughs> Margaret, don't talk. Shh. The big boys are talking now. <laughs> All right. So I have like, what, one persona? I have uh, Izanagi and fucking Pixie. I'll now explain how to create personas through fusion. There's a variety of methods to fuse personas together. A normal spread is fusion of two personas, and a triangle spread is the fusion of three. There are many persona cards that can be used as a base for fusion, and even larger numbers of fusion results. I'm sorry, did I even fucking read that correctly? I had a stroke, didn't I? The drawback is that using multiple personas in a fusion always results in a single persona. Do not forget this, but it's super fucking strong. Also, a persona created through fusion may gain additional powers depending on the day it is created. Refer to the fusion forecast to help ensure that your fusion results go as you desire. If you would like a more detailed explanation, feel free to ask. So you have the fusion forecast here. Ah, oh, Jesus fuck. Alright, thank you about- <laughs> Thank you for asking about the fusion forecast. A persona born through the fusion can be granted various abilities depending on the day of the fusion it is performed. The results are triggers- The result triggers vary day to day and can be seen in the fusion forecast. There may also be unexpected results, so I advise you to please remember to check your fusion before you commit. Effect, bonus stats, trigger, none. What about tomorrow? Use Persona of the Magician Arcana in fusion and it adds Zeo to your persona. Now, here's the thing. You can use fusion forecast, or you can say fuck it, cause honestly, it's not really that important. And most of the time it doesn't help out that much. <laughs> uh, you always, oh my god. All right, fuck you, Margaret. I'm sorry, I love you, but fuck you. <laughs> You always wanna, on your first playthrough anyways, you always wanna register your personas, except for a choice few that will be useful for later down the road. Uh, we'll get to that when that happens, right? So we just have Izanagi and Pixie. Um, whenever you grab a new persona in the dungeon, they automatically will be added to the register from like the base level that you grab them from, so that's pretty cool. So we don't have to manually go in and, you know, Register every persona that we get right off the bat. Skill cards, Marie. Alright, I'll give you a quick explanation about cloning skill cards. If you give me a skill card you have, I can clone them. You'll lose the skill card you gave me, but after that you'll be able to buy as many of them as you like. Oh, the prices will differ depending on the skill, by the way. If you want to strengthen your personas, you should clone a lot of cards. You should make me useful. So, there's none that we have. We'll get skill cards later. Probably hand them to Marie for other personas down the line. Maybe. I don't know, it's kind of weird. It depends on where you get the skill card, right? Because this doesn't really become useful till late game. Because how many times are you going to want to clone fucking Zeo and buy Zeo from someone? It's like low level shit. Alright. So we don't have that many personas. We just have Pixie and Izanagi. We're going to head to the castle. Mm mm. Oh, hey, take this, okay? Obtain, go home. If you don't want to waste time walking back to the entrance, use this to teleport back here. Very helpful. Hmm. Sensei, can I bother you for a second? The hall here seems different from before, so this place might get pretty tricky. But I'm with you. Don't you worry, Sensei. Leave it to me to show you the way. The current surroundings can be seen on the map in the lower left screen. Display button, blah blah blah. It's a map, it's telling you how to use a map. You can send SOS messages to aid back and forth among players. Guess what? It's fucking completely useless. So, who cares? It gives you like, maybe a little health and maybe some stamina back. Nothing that crazy. So first things first, change battle tactics, Chie. I need you to listen to everything I say. Cool. And, uh... Do I have... It's not new game... Ah, oh, shit. Damn it. <laughs> I always press the start button and it sends out the SOS. My bad. Fucking hell. Japan and your press triangle for menu bullshit. I highly doubt that I have anything crazy. Right? Oh, winter clothes. Alright, so. If it was new game plus, I would have, like, all the outfits and I would switch to that. Let's, uh... Sure, why not? Rocking the jersey now. I look like a loser. 
All right. So like I said before, I'm pretty sure I said this before, the uh, dungeons themselves are kind of hallways. They're not your Persona 5, and they're sure as fuck not your Persona 3, which is like a giant tower, right? So, uh, who's weak to what now, if I remember correctly? I think you're weak to Garu? I think you're weak to Garu, too. Nope, you're only weak to zero. Alright, got you. So, the, um, dungeons themselves are pretty much hallways, except for some rooms. Should we show him who's boss? God, the freezing and skipping, that is not me. That is just the fucking PC port. They never fixed it. Alright, shuffle time. I'm pretty sure we talked about this before. Alright, some cards have one more effect, which, if you draw them, you get one more... You know, one more, uh, card you can pick up, or whatever. So, let's see. Change the persona, let's go for that. I'm gonna need you. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Alright. It's been a while since I've ran through a dungeon without blasting through it super hard. So, that means we're gonna have to conserve some energy, but also use... A little bit to make sure we get some levels here and there. Right? I would say... Let's see, what are our levels, by the way? Stats, what we're looking at. 5, 4, 4? I would say around, like, 9. Level 9 is pretty good. Just make sure that these shadows don't get the drop on you. There's one enemy. Smash it. Also... Don't forget that you can just do some basic attacks. You want to save your SP as much as possible. Good job, Yosuke. So, save your energy as much as possible. Uh, when it comes to... Yes, we found the stairs. They can lead you up there anytime. Okay, thank you, Teddy. Great. Um, oh shit. <laughs> so yeah, we, uh... What's call it? SP recovery items are far and few. In this game. And if you do get them, they're so... They're so, like... They're so small. But they cost so much goddamn money. You can use those things I gave you at the entrance to get back. He's trying to walk back. Yes. Hmm? I sent someone beyond this door. Open the door. Fuck yeah. Oh my god, Yukiko! Yukiko? We're here to save you. Yukiko-san, are you alright? Yukiko, what's wrong? <laughs> guests. I wonder how they'll play into all this. Oh my. <laughs> Things are really heating up. Okie dokie. I'm going back to hunt for my Prince Charming. Oh, where could he be? Okie dokie. I'm going back to whore myself out. <laughs> this place is huge. It's so exciting. But it makes it so hard to find him. Oh, maybe he's playing hide-and-seek in the fog. <laughs> Ready or not, here I come. Let's go further in then, shall we? Princess Yukiko hunt for her Prince Charming. What the hell is this? You're not Yukiko. Who are you? <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm Yukiko, and Yukiko is me. We're all Yukiko. Oh, thanks for the follow- shit. I should- I should actually boost that up. <laughs> Cause I wasn't able to hear it. I honestly was not able to hear it. Uh... Let's see. No, I think it might be at a good level. Sorry. But thanks for the follow, I appreciate it. Now if I can find my fucking cursor again, there we go. <laughs> Don't tell me. Are you? Where's the real Yukiko? First playthrough? No. This actually isn't my first playthrough. Uh, the reason why I put no spoilers because this is this is a playthrough that's, you know, it, it it's a playthrough for people to watch. It's going to go up on the YouTube channel. So for those who haven't uh, played or beaten Persona 4, I don't want to spoil too much for them. What's with these voices? 
The shadows are getting agitated. Well, I'm off again. <laughs> you better be waiting with bells on, my dear prince. So when uh, so um, when refer when referring to the culprit, I appreciate it if you just call him culprit, <laughs> right? Hey, wait! Oh no! That clearly wasn't the real Yukiko. Oh, it gave it away, Che. Was it the glowing yellow eyes, or was it the blue Super Saiyan aura? Must have been the other part of herself. So it's just like what happened to us. But I don't think she was excited for nothing. The real Yukiko wants to show us something. I can feel it. It's hard to explain. It seems like she has a strong connection to this castle. This is a lot more dangerous than I thought. You think? You think, Teddy? Yukiko! Hey! Not again. Damn it, we told her not to run off on her own. God damn it, Chie. <coughs> All right. Time to run through a goddamn hallway for like, <laughs> for like what, 10 minutes maybe? Uh, it's Final Fantasy 13 all over. You hear voices from somewhere. My prince will come for me. I'll always be waiting. Forever and ever. And I hear her voice. But all I sense around here are you guys in the shadows. Watch out for the shadows and keep going. When a shadow has its back to you, carefully get in close and smack it. And by carefully getting close, it means run as fast as you can and smack that motherfucker in the back. Because stealth ain't worth a damn in this game. This ain't your fucking Persona 5. No, oh, it's a hand. There's only one enemy. Beat his ass. Oh. It's resistance against physical. I'm so not used to playing a regular game. I'm so used to fucking just going through the game. I think it's weak to ice, but we don't have it. Jesus, fuck. Zahando, yes. That is a very, that is a very, very cheeky way of getting a reference in there. Something inside of you has changed. All right, so I guess I'm gonna have to actually be looking into these chests. Something I normally never do, because we're gonna need some items. God damn it. Most of the time, I'm just gonna run past these guys, though. <laughs> now, the golden chests, you can only open those by getting chi- Uh, ugh, god, I can't speak. By getting keys- <laughs> I, I mixed the word chest and keys together, and I said cheese. Um, by getting keys through the, uh, roulette card bullshit, right? You pick that up, you head to a chest, and usually you get something that's pretty good for that dungeon. It won't last you for the whole entire- game though sadly let's see just tell the shadow how much you like to cut <laughs> what's my difficulty normal not doing anything crazy uh i originally back uh back when i first did this playthrough on my channel which had which i honestly didn't like so i deleted it we didn't finish the game by the way um my plan was to play it on hard right and i did that it wasn't too bad right but I just felt like I wasn't doing the playthrough right, so here's the plan. Persona 4 is a great entry point for Persona. For people who like it, we're gonna play it on normal, right? New game, normal, nothing crazy, nothing fancy. When we get to Persona 3, or 3 Portable, or 5, 5 the Royal, uh, then I'll think about doing it on hard mode. Maybe on Persona 5, because it's just a little easier with all the, uh, quality of life stuff. But, um... As for Persona 4, I'm not I'm not doing a playthrough on it hard, especially not streaming, because we'll be here for fucking weeks. I mean, we're going to be here for weeks regardless, but we'll be here, like, for a year. You don't want that. <laughs> Thank you for coming to the Magi Inn today. Your room's right this way. If we can help you in any way, please let us know immediately. What's this voice talking about? This place isn't an inn. It's totally a castle. Oh, Teddy, you stupid... Bear, how I love you. Shadow's gonna pop out, right? Ice Cube! You found a wrapper inside a box. <laughs> he screams at you angrily. Alright. I smell three enemies! 
Don't get careless. Yosuke, I think the birds are weak to Garo. Nope, they resisted. Ow, that hurts. Pain is pain, and pain is bad. That was a good one, Sensei. Go, Sensei. Knocked it down. All right, you're weak to either ice or fire. I don't remember. It might be fire. I think it's fire. Uh, it got uh, back hmm. up. Hurry and beat it. Damn, Chie. God damn it, Chie. <laughs> They're beating your ass. Chie, level up and learn fucking Bufu or some shit. Well, let's just get one out the equation. Ow, that hurts. Painfully. Just gonna do that. Make sure you're out of the equation. Uh... I'm at 31 health. Let's be careful, right? <laughs> Chie, best waifu? Listen. I can't take sides, alright? We're just gonna let nature play its course. But when those important days come around, I wanna see people fighting each other in the chat. I wanna see somebody get cut. <laughs> Alright. So Chie, right? Yosuke is pretty good. He's well balanced, more towards uh, magic attacks or whatever the fuck, right? Chie is a glass cannon. Strong physical hits. Can't take a hit worth a damn. Neither can I. Damn, I haven't had. I haven't had my ass kicked that good in a while. Let's see. Let's grab Chesky. Some men just want to watch the whole world burn, huh? A little bit, yeah. <laughs> a little bit. Listen, this ain't your Persona 5. No one- We can't sit down and have a nice council and go, All waifus are created equal. Except for that bitch Oya over there, cause she sucks. Uh, <laughs> you know. Persona 5 was pretty tamed when it came out, I have to say, right? For, um... The whole life of aspect of it, but fucking Persona 4 was just cut and dry. Let's see. Yosuke, you're gonna be our main healer right now. So, uh, get to work, you bitch. Throw those heals out. You know what I'm talking about, Yosuke? I wanna sound like a goddamn an Overwatch player. Where's my heals, man? Alright, so we got ourselves a chest key. You shouldn't worry about shadows popping out of here. Chewing soul. That's nice. That's nice. That's great for Yosuke. <laughs> Yosuke was your healing slave, for real? For the whole game? Wait. Not for the whole game, right? Can't be for the whole game. Okay, by the way, I, I forgot to mention this. Um, The size of the shadows equate to uh, how strong they are. So smaller shadows are, of course, weaker. Bigger ones gonna take some hits and red ones usually have fun items that will drop for you it seems strong, oh but I'm sure you'll win. that's not good <laughs> that's not good okay i'll look for an opening for you yikes uh let's see Yosuke barely has any health. Yeah, you think I would you think I would notice that, huh? Yeah, we gotta get the fuck out of here. Bitch. Uh Yosuke, you're so gonna die, but let me see what Garu does. I don't quite remember. Alright, well, I'm gonna <sighs> fuck, should I guard? There's a chance I can get a critical off and then get an all-out attack. If it was New Game Plus, be easy as fuck. Oh, don't worry. Trust me. You just run on through it. Right? Don't even do it, man. Come on. It's the beginning of the game. You're throwing out instant kill attacks. 
Ow, wow, that hurt. Teddy, when the fuck can I escape? How about that, Teddy? How about that? You know? How about that, Teddy? When can I escape? When can I get the fuck out of here? Oh, you're weak to that. Great. Great. Nice. Now, I'm gonna guard, just in case. Because if you dies, it's all- it's all over. Right? Doesn't matter if these other motherfuckers die. Che, you're fucking useless. <laughs> you fucking garbage! I hate you! Chance to run. Fuck yeah, I'm getting out of here. Leave Chie for dead. Now, here's the thing. If this was Persona 3, it'd be really fucking funny. Because in Persona 3, when your character dies and you run from a battle, they stay dead until you revive them. Well, not... They don't stay dead until you revive them. They stay knocked out on that floor until you revive them. And if you move on to the next floor without them, they just go, man, fuck it, I'm out of here. <laughs> SOS, I need help. S.O.S. Please, someone help me. Alright, let's see. Yosuke? Pour that ass out. You know what I mean? Oh, it's been a while. It's been a while since I had to actually play this game seriously. So here's what's gonna happen. Right? Because I'm a crazy son of a bitch. Where is she? Hmm. Oh, I can sense her. She must be on this floor. Damn it. So here's what's gonna happen, right? Wow, by any chance, are you my prince? I'm locked up here. Please save me. Sure, my prince can do it. I'm sure they'll brave any danger to release me from this place. I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> oh. This seems very strange. Be careful. Alright, so here's what's gonna happen. We're gonna get to... We're gonna go as far as we can. Oh, this one's really strong! On the floors. And then, and then we're gonna use go home to go back down, grind on the lower Let's levels, go. and then go back up. Let's go. All right. Ready or not, here we come. Really? That's what my all attack does? Really? Damn it! It's not going down. Two enemies. Charge through them. My attack is down. Great. She is only useless at the start once you get Rampage. She's a monster. Really? Every time I've gotten Rampage for Chie and I told her to use it, all she did was miss. Every single goddamn time. I've never hit a Rampage a day in my life. Alright, we're gonna get this. That's gonna help a lot. Hey, congrats! Another level for me! Yosuke learned Tsukukaja, which boosts our speed. Thank you very much, Yosuke. Oh, I read that one different earlier. Spam Yoshitsune the whole time. Yeah, Yoshitsune. <laughs> Not Yoshitsune. Listen, Yoshitsune doesn't matter. What you want is Hasotobi. <laughs> Just name the persona Hasotobi. Or as I like to call it, the Toby Hustle. <laughs> Alright. So, this is as far as... Well, it's not as far as we can go, but I know we're gonna have to deal with a fucking, like, mini-boss in a bit. So, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna pull out this Go Home. Memories of Chie just constantly failing or missing attacks haunts me. Exactly. Maybe in Persona uh, 4 Vanilla, right? You, what you doing? We're, just, we're about to fucking grind, Yosuke. You ever heard of that? We're gonna grind. Something I didn't have to do in Persona for a long time. Something that, something that becomes super obsolete in Persona 5 uh, The Royal. Vanish Ball, that's going to be very helpful. Get us out of death instantly. Come here, buddy. Now, when you go to attack the shadows, don't forget that there's a bit of a delay to pressing that attack button, so they can still get the drop on you. Yours really misses? Well, guess what? Why have Chie if you can just have Kanji take over? <laughs> He's a tank, baby. Just throw it out. Someone else's turn. Nice damage, Josuke. Uh, it got back up! Hurry and beat it! 
in their fight. And we're placing it. No one stands in Sensei's way. Moves, Beautiful. Partner. Kanji MPV? Exactly. MVP Kanji. He takes hits. He gives hits. The only thing that sucks is his magic. But that's okay. Revival beat. That's useful. We need that. Two enemies. You can attack before them. Go, Sensei. You knocked nice. it down. Now I'm using a lot of goddamn magic here. I got some peach seeds and like a chewing soul. My plan is to open some golden chests. Right? Replace Yosuke with Kanji. Really? You can replace Yosuke. Yosuke's great. I would replace Yosuke. Uh, Yosuke. <laughs> uh, void counter, recovers. Yeah, no. We're gonna do that. I would replace uh, Yosuke with. Oh, shit. I don't know, Yosuke is pretty fast, right? I like having a fast character on my side. I can bring Yosuke through the whole game. All I know is, uh, I constantly, I constantly find it hard to have, uh, to have, uh, our detective friend <laughs> stay on our team for any long period of time, because I don't know what to use her for. There are two enemies! Hang in there! Alright, let's get to at least level wow, 7, maybe? Yeah, you got it, Yosuke. Just take it out of the equation. Just beat it up resently. Resentlessly. Alright, what we got here? XP, Persona, change to Persona. Why would you ever half your XP? Why would you ever do that? <laughs> Yay, you learned Bufu. You're somewhat useful now. Thank you, Chie. Thank you. Fucking coconut head. <laughs> Out here looking like Ned's Declassified School Survival Guide. Now it's as good until she runs out of SP. Only one <laughs> oh, so you mean for a whole two seconds? <laughs> like... Oh my fucking god, you? Are you okay? My man out here getting crits. Like it's no one's business. Chia's god hand is really great, though. Chia's god hand is great, but you can also have Izanagi learn god hand, so what? You know, why do it? <laughs> Gonna need Angel. That's for Nanako. Uh, 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 uh. Alright. Mm, 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 mm. Peach Seed. Nice. Gonna need that. Gonna, gonna fucking... What, what's her name? Persephone? The one that Hades tucked down to the underworld or whatever? That Zeus whored off to Hades? Gonna Persephone, Yosuke, just throw a bunch of pomegranate seeds down his throat. Be like, can you heal me now? Alright. Let's get one more level, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head back to the entrance, save the game, because if we die, we're fucked. There are three enemies! Careful! Oh, come on, Yosuke! You got one job! Hey Teddy, shut the fuck up. It's down. <laughs> Now's okay. Beat up a bunch of birds. He keeps level up and gets no new skills. I'm saying you give the skills to him. I know he doesn't fucking get any skills. Listen. Three enemies. Let's get through this. Or you can con or here's the thing, you can constantly just have Izanagi on your team when the cards come up. Like, did they just Son of a bitch. Awesome! Chie-chan's in rampage mode! 
Sorry, I got I got turned around because I saw them buff themselves. Or you can just constantly pick up the uh, Magician card, which boosts, which brings a random skill to the next level. Just do that for Izanagi. You'll get God Hand. <laughs> Cleave will turn into God Hand over time. Uh, skill card? No, not really. Money up. Money. You don't play the golden version? Oh, yeah. Really, you don't play- mm. No wonder why your Chi ain't missing Rampage left and right, because you're playing vanilla. Motherfucker. Jesus. <laughs> Fucking shadows jumping out of boxes. I smell two enemies. Beat them up. Let's just be happy they don't get the drop on us. Uh, you're weak to ice. Someone else's turn. I'll just kill you. Jay, so make yourself Good useful. It's down. Okay. Give it up. Yeah, but um, why don't you play golden? Is it because of Marie? Is it because of Marie? Is that it? Is it because they put Poochie in the game? Oh, hell yeah. Picking that up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's because of... Because <laughs> Poochie's there. Poochie's there laying in bed with Dio talking about I've been here the whole time Dio the guy's only like 17 why are you guys laying in bed butt naked what's going on with that <laughs> Jesus I love Jojo Jojo's great <laughs> Joe's is great, but what the hell are they doing? Dio's a power bottom? Oh god. Yeah, with his fucking solid snake ass, I bet he's crushing Poochie. I smell three enemies. Don't get careless. I won't. It's not going down. I won't make any promises. Three enemies! Let's get through this! You what the fuck was that? <laughs> Come on, man. Woohoo, Chichan! That's one. That's some thick yep. skin. Two enemies Just left. rush it. At that point. That's my true strength. Mm mm mm. All right. Got to make our way towards the entrance. Cuz I don't want to waste the go home. Not yet anyways. Give ourselves a little pat on the back, and then- oh shit, I'm going the wrong way. Oh fuck. Oh fuck, and I have to deal with two rounds. There are two enemies! Hang in there! Someone else's turn. Come on. There you go. Great, sensei. Nice go use, for broke. <laughs> more enemies. Two more enemies! You gotta hang tight! Eh, it's not too bad. Sensei, right, go for oh, now you get a critical Yosuke. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Jesus. I'm gonna grab that. Now, at some point, I remember Maka Jam being useful. I think it's only useful for like one boss fight, if I remember correctly. Peach Seed, thank you. And I think it's for, uh, the boss in the laboratory, right? That's the only time I think Maka Jam was ever useful to me? Or am I thinking about Persona Vanilla, right? P4 Vanilla? Let's see. Golden Wind was so good, you wish you was in Italy. Is Golden Wind that good? Here's the thing. I'm about to make a lot of people mad. I said it before, I'll say it again. Part 3 is the worst fucking part of JoJo. I will die on that hill. I will die on that hill. It is so... It's not... Bad, bad, because they're all good, but it is the worst out of them all. What do you mean, what the fuck? Let me explain myself, right? Alright, so you got part one. Yeah, it's slow, but it start, but it builds up everything. It shows you what's going on, right? It teaches you who Dio is, right? Huh? Oh, hey, Poochie, what's up? <laughs> you came. You must come here a lot. What do you want this time? A persona? Skill card? Eh, it doesn't matter to me. Excuse me, Marie. You must learn to restrain yourself. Huh? Stop putting out whore. That's what she said. 
What's that supposed to mean? Stupid type. Stupid type blockhead twerp. Call her a twerp? <laughs> I apologize sincerely. She's far too unruly for me to handle. <laughs> I feel ya. <laughs> You're quite right. However, this is all to help you on your journey. What do you mean? This room is inseparable from your fate. Nothing in this room happens without purpose. It seems that you and Marie had already met before you encountered her in this room. Encountering one who is not of man and communicating with her, your fate has led you to this meeting. It's not my problem. <laughs> it's not my problem. Well now, we'll see. She said, yeah, about that. I'm not sure about that one, Chief. This room is crossroads of your fate. You, the customer, she who is not of man, you have... You has one wait what? Who has wandered into this place? I had a stroke. Uh, where will this meeting lead? Excuse me for saying so, but we too are a bit interested in the outcome. Though she was in the land before you in the end, Marie is not of man. In other words, her understanding of the world is which and which you live is incomplete. Therefore, I ask of you to take her outside of this room. But of course, you are occupied at the moment, visiting interior of the tele television world. Please ask her when you have the time on your hands. Okay, Marie? Whatever. Whatever. It's not like I like you or anything. Never mind. Seems Marie is interested in leaving this place. You should speak with her once you've left the TV world. Alright. I'm sorry, worst part is six? <laughs> what? Have you read the manga? <laughs> I'm assuming you have. What do you mean the worst part? Is All right, hold up. You're crazy. That's like seven. That's like saying seven's the worst part. What's wrong with you? <laughs> What's wrong with this man? <laughs> Gonna register our personas. Only Izanagi. Okay. Um, view compendium. No, not view. My bad. Uh, gonna fuse. Search. I like doing search. Fuck you, Igor. Search just shows you what you can do right now. That's it. Nothing crazy. Uh, level 8, which we can't have yet because I'm not level 8. So we should level up it like one more time. Or Bors. Comes with Agi, Hysterical Slap. Anyone comes with Ice? <laughs> uh, Bufudia. This is level 11. Alertness. And takes Pixie. What's your face? An angel. Alright, yeah. Oh, we have a 7 right here. Who's that take? Oh, we can get ice off of this. Right? She has Bufu? Do you not have Bufu? Oh my fucking god, you're useless to me. <laughs> oh no. Uh, you come with ice, right? Yeah, Bufu, Rakunda. Rakunda's good. Uh, you're a hermit though, so I won't get any boost off of you just yet. I won't get any boost off of anybody just yet, so it's not, you know, it's not that crazy. Um... Shit. <laughs> you would come with... Alright. Sorry, just just kind of going in my head like, who am I going to grab? Uh, she lost to a... <laughs> Spoilers, man! Spoilers. Yeah, but that's cool, though. Listen, that had to have happened, right? Because, whatchamacallit... Araki fucking wrote himself <laughs> into a corner because he's like, listen, at some point we got to get rid of fucking, uh, what's his name? Jotaro, because I made him too strong. Made him too strong to where the answer is, why not freeze time all the goddamn time, right? Because they're like, they're like, you can stop time for, um, for like a couple of seconds, but they never talk about how long it takes to recover from that. Right? Is like, is it an hour? Doesn't seem like it. Alright. But to me, part three is the worst. Out of all of them. And the reasoning for that is because you have part one. You know, it gets everything started. You learn who Dio is. You learn you learn why Dio is a threat. Right? And then it, you know, it starts the legacy. Part two is just great. Let's be honest. Pillar men are great. <laughs> Pillar men are great. Part two is just amazing. It's great. You can't, you can't lie. You can't say you didn't drop some manly ass tears at Caesar, right? 
And then part three becomes the Monster of the Week gang with like really no really no like character progression at all and even the villain is someone who is someone who like they don't even ex like in part three they don't explain to you who Dio is they just assume you already know right it's like oh here's Dio he's a rival of the family he's bad time the fuck off until the end of the series right <laughs> like nothing happens like a bunch of funny shit happens, yeah, but like the most care the most like character progression you get is like Paul Noref, maybe. Where he's all like, Oh, my sister was killed by two by a man with fucking two left hands. And then you find the guy and they kill him and that's it. Nothing else really happens. All right? I two enemies. Beat them up. It's like, yeah, it introduces stands or whatever, but eh. You know? Can always do better. Two right hands. Who gives a fuck? Two left, two right. It doesn't stop it. It doesn't make a difference. <laughs> it doesn't make a difference. Yeah, it, I don't know. Part three is just weird. <laughs> Part three has a lot of jokes and it's funny and it's fun to watch, right? But that's all it is. It's just fun to watch. Nothing actually happens, nothing actually changes. Right. For some reason, everyone hates Part Four, and I I think it's because they're like, "Where's the badass characters? Everyone's acting like a goofball." It's like, it's like, yeah, everyone's acting like a fucking goofball. It's fucking JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, the same the same series where the guy's like, now, <laughs> what was the guy who fucking died to deal by getting frozen or whatever? He's like, my cross-chop ability, you can't beat this, it's the perfect form of defense and attack. And then Dio goes, what if I just headbutt you, though? <laughs> like, also, part three just has so many inconsistencies. One of the biggest gripes that I have is like, at the end when Dio and Jotaro are fighting, it's like, why are you guys fucking Super Saiyans? What happened? Where, where did that come from? Right? At least with like a uh, golden wind or something, it's like, all right, we we fucking super pierced ourselves with the arrow, I guess. But like, you know, <laughs> they're like Super Saiyans. Jotaro goes, so you stop time. I guess our stands are the same. And Dio goes like, yeah, I guess. I don't know. And then two seconds later, he's like, now I stop time. And it's like, what? Did I hit him? Did he hit me? What happened? There we go. Part three is all over the place, man. I love, I love JoJo. I love him. Yeah. Part three is just all over the place for me. And then we can all agree that part seven is probably the best. <laughs> That's of course with with me uh not reading part not reading part eight yet. I was waiting for part eight to end, and I think it ended in 2014. Because I know it was still going on in 2011. See? Broke. Don't do anything fun yet. The ad's over. Wait, ads are playing on this? Oh yeah, ads are playing on this. I keep forget about that. Oh, by the way, speaking of ads and stuff. Fucking, um... If you're followed on the channel or whatever, you get some you get some emotes. Yay, I up! Jojo TED Talk. I didn't see that. Yeah, pretty much. It's me hopping on the hopping on the stage of a TED Talk and going, "All right, guys, listen, you're all gonna hate me for this controversial part three sucks." <laughs> Everyone's like, "What?" Oh shit! All right, so whenever you hear that noise, oh fuck! Whenever you hear that noise, heavy breathing, chains moving, and stuff like that, that means the Reapers here. I smell three enemies. And the Reaper is here to stop you from power leveling like I am right now. Because he goes, listen. Stop that cheating bullshit. Great, Sensei. Go for broke. Alright, uh oh shit, I'm out of SP. We'll be fine. Nice shot, GA. Yosuke barely has any health. Time to beat its ass. Oh yeah. If it's down already within the turn. God damn it. Fight, fight, fight! Don't think. 
<laughs> Don't think. Yeah, Chia, I bet you're used to doing that, huh? Alright, uh, Gyro's in part 7. It is good. Yeah, Gyro Sapelli. What the fuck you want me to do, Yosuke? Suck your nuts? Like, wh what's going on, man? <laughs> I can barely move. Do something. I don't know. Seems like your legs are working to me. Alright, so... I think the Reaper can... In this game, can he go through walls? <laughs> oh, shit. Alright, so to avoid the Reaper, you just gotta head to a different floor. That's all you gotta do. I don't wanna see the Reaper. Reaper will kill us. It's gonna have bad time. Welcome back, Sensei. Alright. What level are we? I don't know why I went to Personas. Why did I do that? Stats, what level are we? Seven? Still seven? Shit. Hmm. Alright. Alright, here's what's gonna happen. Chewing Soul. Yosuke, there you go. I'm gonna give myself some peach seeds. Soul drop. That's good. Um... Heading in, we're gonna change persona. The Reaper chasing me. <laughs> Doesn't scare you, it's just fucking dead. <laughs> yeah. Reaper's scary, man. What's scary is when, uh, in Persona 3, if you tell your team to separate and one of them runs into the Reaper and you just see them, <laughs> you see all three of them fighting the Reaper and you're just, like, hanging back. You're like, yeah, you got it, guys. You're like, man, we're so dead. <laughs> we're so dead. <laughs> Alright. Guess I'm gonna be using you, then. Uh, we're gonna pass on... You don't learn Rakunda, right? So, Rakunda's good. And... Terunda, Terracadra, Dia. Yeah, we're gonna go Dia. Because Chie has Terracadra, right? It's not the persona I want, but it's the one we're gonna do. I should have let the animation play. I am uh, I am Oyo Kane. Oh, God. Oyo Kane, or whatever the fuck your name is. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm gonna suck your brain juices. Thanks, Igor. All right. Mm. Now we're gonna run up to the to the med boss, right? Gonna do that. Just uh, rotate those saves, baby. All right, guys. Let's see. The Reaper in Persona Three boss memory still haunts me. Gonna head out right and go to sleep. Okay, yeah. Thanks for stopping by, Breezy. I appreciate it. it helps out a lot. <laughs> Might get banned. Put that motherfucker frost out there. It's good and you should fuse it, yeah. Jack Frost is pretty good. Alright, who are we fighting? You That's are a strong enemy! Don't get hurt! Thanks for the help, Teddy. It's a strong enemy, don't get hurt. I forgot what you're weak to. I think you're weak to fire, actually. I think you're gonna kill us. No, you're not weak to fire. You're weak to ice. Alright, cool. Jay, do something. Help us. You're not weak to ice. Get a critical, Yosuke. Make yourself useful. Damn it. Um... I just want to check the Persona stats real quick. You're good with magic, right? Yeah, magic. Okay. Magic is your way. It's your Nindo. It's your Nindo way. <laughs> Cause it's my Nindo. My ninja way. Amazing, Sensei! Keep it up! Alright. Great. Alright. Uh, da, 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 da. I also want to point out, I think I put auto mod back on to the chat. Twitch, for some reason, didn't see that that word was bad, you know? So I guess maybe they're just like, ah, fuck it, whatever. <laughs> Listen, it's okay with me as long as ERs ain't getting dropped. That's what I'm saying, you know what I'm talking about? Because I, I live in the ghetto. I hear that word a lot. I don't care.
I remember one time someone came to chat and just dropped an ER, and I was like, what the fuck is wrong with you? They're like, well, I'm calling myself it. I'm like, that... Well, it doesn't matter. What? <laughs> like, I don't get offended over that word, but come on, don't hop in the chat, do that, and have other people see that shit. No one wants to see that. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Stay away from me. I don't want to fight you. I know what I'm doing, by the way. I know it looks like I don't know what I'm doing, but I know what I'm doing. I checked that room already. Shit. <laughs> it's gonna teleport me right in front of that fucking enemy. I'm gonna have to fight him. Yep. Two enemies! You can attack before them! Um I don't know what you guys are weak to, so I'm just gonna punch you. Nope. Damn, Yosuke. Yosuke out here getting his ass beat. That's what's happening. <laughs> oh, that's not good. And reach out to the truth of my lives are gonna see. Eh, why not? Oh, so you are weak to win. Fuck. You know, I see the table, I'm like, it's wood. It should be weak to fire. Hang in there. Oh, that's not gonna help you. That's my truth. Shut up, Yosuke. Right, I, leveled up. I love you, Yosuke. You're the best. All right. Are you all right, Yosuke? You're hurt. Thanks for reminding me, Teddy. I actually was about to run to that fight without uh, without healing that guy. Oh, I used all our peach seeds. Fuck, Yosuke. You know, touch yourself up. I said, touch yourself up, not touch yourself. Door seems to be locked. Okay, that's the locked one. And over here should be the one with the mini boss. Door seems to be locked. What? Excuse me? <laughs> Excuse me? What? <laughs> what happened? Is that the same door? I think that might be the same door. Uh oh. That's not good. It seems strong, but I'm sure you'll win. I think it's weak to ice. And it was it was strong against physical, right? That's some thick skin. Alright. Just one enemy left. Way to dodge my fucking attack. Jesus. There you go. The beginning of Persona is always the hardest. God damn it. How much would this do? Oh no, it's going down. If you didn't miss, Jesus. There was another enemy nearby? Yosuke, work your magic, literally. What did you do today? Oh, nothing. I just, me and my friends just dogpiled a bunch of chairs and tables. Fighting kitchen utensils. Oh, lucky you didn't go for Yosuke on that one. Good job, Jay. Cracker at level 11? Fuck, man. <laughs> Gee, come on. <laughs> Alright. Sensei, are you okay? Your health's low. I know my health is low, okay? Listen, shut up, Teddy. <laughs> I'm trying my best. I forgot that I had Dia, too. Jesus. Oh, 
Ah, oh, fucking what? The dice has to be here? Really? Fuck it. I didn't want to use it yet, but fuck it. We're out of here. I'm not dealing with no last resort bullshit. Not yet. It's not happening. We're not doing that. Nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Alright, this is the door. Since someone beyond this door, it's the girl sent. Open the door. Yes. My prince wouldn't lose to guards such as this, right? i never seen such a strong one before. It's attacking us! What enemy ambushed you? Hang in there! Yeah, see, about that whole, uh, whatchamacallit... That, uh, Terracotta shit, it's not gonna fly. Someone else's turn. One enemy! Fight! 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 Yeah, that's not gonna fly, my guy. We're just gonna... Do that. <laughs> uh, Terukaja on yourself, GA. Uh oh. I'm not gonna risk it. <laughs> it's not happening. We're not risking that. Alright. Um, that was a strong hit. God, I'm so used to just- I'm so used to just smacking things with a sword in this game. Uh, let's see, well... Chie's about to hit you with her foot, so... <laughs> about to stomp on that motherfucker! Ooh! Nice job, Jay. Ow! Pain is pain and it hurts. One oh eight, I'll take that. You know, fucking you and Yosuke are just gonna be touching each other for a good moment. Sorry. <sighs> Jesus. All right. Well, that wasn't worth it. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go with Gar. It's not going down. Mm mm mm. Four and then twelve. Eh. We'll do that. <laughs> you just po you just post the whole entire Yoshikage Kira fucking monologue. Oh my god, my favorite. Uh, do you ever see the video where it's just like three birds <laughs> and they're doing it? It's like I wake up every. I I fucking have like a warm cup of milk before night or some bullshit. Um. I'm not gonna risk using her health yet. Ah, oh, shit. 80, 80, okay, great. They won't die from a, from guarding. No one should die. Cool. Yeah, you can get GA. The limit's 500 characters, so it's not the full one. <laughs> oh, shit. Um... Well, I have no magic, so... Smack it. Gotta play this strategically. I don't want to, but I have to, against everything that I've taught myself over the couple of years. You gotta head out? No problem. Thanks for stopping by. It's great appreciated. Company's nice. I like it. Uh, <laughs> oh shit! It's down. Here's our chance. Let's go. Let's do it. Fuck him up. It and its defense is down. Ah oh, shit! It didn't do that much, but hey, helped out. Quite beat it. Poison skewer. Oh no, that's bad. Poison's bad. Poison's bad. Poison's bad. Poison's bad. Oh, I don't have anything for that. Oh, damn it! Sensei, hurry and get rid of that poison! I can't. <laughs> it's impossible for me. Jesus, poison skewer. What a piece of shit. I hate you. Just gonna have to attack. 
Just one enemy left. Oh shit, nice job, Jay. That looked like it hurt. Uh -huh. Is this our chance? Let's do it! This is it! Ah oh, shit, if he goes for Yosuke, we're fucked. Because I can't 50. I'm trying to like add in the poison in my mind. You know what? No, we can guard from it. We'll be fine. We should be fine. 14? Yeah, okay. Yeah, we should be fine. Gotta keep you up. Ah, uh, no longer poison. Thank you. No longer poison, there you go. And it's a critical. Oh, fuck off. Woo! <laughs> Gave me a heart attack. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Sensei's back on his feet. Yeah, not for long, though. Couldn't quite beat it. Fucking power charge. Insufficient SP. Fuck you. It's not going down. Come on, Chie. Work your magic. Someone finish it off! Oh my fucking god. We won! Alright. <laughs> gotta step up too. Heart attack avoided. Oh man, I can't wait till we get the fucking fox here so it can help us. Glass key has been obtained. You really are my prince. Then we will surely meet again. I am but a trapped soul. I cannot leave this place, even if I wished. I don't sense her anymore. Oh, are you okay, Sensei? I'm sure we got a long ways to go. Don't push yourself. Actually, we have like how many floors to go? If you're tired, you should head back. Fuck off. We have like five more floors to go. Maybe four. It's not that long. Just gotta make sure we don't die on the way there. Uh, items. We have some life stones. Excuse me, I just burped into the mic. I had to think about it. Soul drops. I'll save that for the end. I'll save that when we get to the actual door. Alright, now that the boss is gone, we don't have to deal with the teleporting room anymore. And I think this is the door we go through. Doors locked, glass key. Like Cinderella is the- oh. Go home, yes! I'll take those. Thank you very much. At least I don't have to pay for them, right? <laughs> I feel so naked being weak and broke in this game. I haven't had this feeling in such a long time. Oh my fucking god. Can I- hold up. Just run past you like this? Yep, 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 no problem. Door slot, glass key. Alright. In other words, she's a manager who's still in high school. Now that has a nice ring to it. Let's see if we can interview her, excuse me. Shut up. Hey, Yukiko-san, mind if I ask you something? Is it true that the announcer's staying at your family's inn? Shut up. Someday, uh, someday though. That aside, wow, you're looking gorgeous in that kimono. I bet a lot of people are touching themselves right now. Leave me alone. I'm sick of it. It is sickening. I don't get what's going on with all those voices, but I can sense that's where we're getting closer. Hang in there. It would have been nice if that was just the stairs right there. But nope, nothing can never be that simple. Oh. Yes, give it to me. Hey, Volt Suppressor! Yosuke, that is wonderful for you. Because you're weak to that. <laughs> That's wonderful. Oh, shit. Uh oh, this one's really strong! This one might actually kill us. Okay, I'll look for an opening for 
Mmm. Not good. Ah, oh, God, I have nothing. Just coward. Che, we're not in any position. All right. in danger. Heal her. I know, I know. Thank you. Come on, Teddy, help us out here. Be patient. I need to find an opening first. You need to be patient, motherfucker. I'm dying. Yosuke's in danger. He needs help. I taste blood. Oh my fucking god, Teddy, please. Oh, there! Now's your chance to run! Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Jesus. I'm gonna fight that hand, dude. He's gonna bitch slap me in the next week. The stairs! Hasn't my prince come yet? My dear prince, please hurry and take me away. Somewhere. To a world where no one knows me. It's close. Just beyond here. Beyond here? If we can find ourselves another golden chest, that'll be nice. I... Didn't mean to do that. Enemy in there. <laughs> oh, a chest. Shadow's gonna jump out. Magic mirror! Fuck yeah, let's go! All right. So, about like, what, one more, maybe two more floors? We'll be at the boss. And then I'll use a go home, save the game so that we don't... So if we do get our asses handed to us, we don't have to do all this shit again. And then, uh... Maybe fuse a persona if we can. <gasps> Come here! Wait, never mind, can you beat me up? You might be able to beat me up, I'm not sure. Come here! Damn it! Don't run from me! No! Come here, come here, come here, come on. Ha-ha! A rare monster! Beat its ass. Out of it. Oh, damn it. Thanks a lot, Yosuke. Don't give up! Couldn't quite beat it. Yeah, okay, it wasn't worth it. Way to make me feel sad about myself, Jesus. Thanks for fucking it up, Yosuke. All right, we did it. Now, pop that go home. Head back to that entrance. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Just wish the fox was here. All we need is the fox. Make my life better. All right. Uh, I think I have enough persona to to do something. Right. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm level 9. Do we have any level 9ers out here? Nope. I have level 59. Or Boris. Jack Frost 16. We can't. We can't fuse Jack Frost. I would love to, but we can't. Uh, Well, level 8's the only one, and that has Strong Against Fire. That can actually really help out, though. Dodge Ice. Uh, What are we fusing with that? Slime, you, and you. And this one's Angel and and Aquabak, or the fuck you pronounce his name. Hmm. Evil Touch, Bash, Garu, Dia. Skills will you teach it? Uh, Dia and Garu. Yes, it is acceptable. That triangle spread. Uh, 
I am Morabas. Very well. You shall have my strength at your disposal. Look at my magic hands. <laughs> Throw my gang signs. <laughs> he turns around, pose for the camera. Hey, level 9. It's strong with magic. All right. Mm -hmm. I didn't pick up any skill cards at all, did I? While I'm sitting here doing all this. Yeah, no skill cards. I'm gonna save it one more time. Uh, let's see. Items. We have some soul drops. The ones who are gonna be using SP the most. Chie. Um... There's a chance Chie will probably die. <laughs> Reflects magic only one time for one ally. I'll throw that on Chie. Well, I can't throw it on Chie, because then it'll heal her. It will heal Yukiko, right? Or Shadow, anyways. Sorry, I had to listen to that last part of the music. Alright, let's move on. It's good, I like it. I like it. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm about to run in there, fucking Yosuke's still, like, half dead. Uh, oh, fuck, you gotta be kidding me. Hmm, damn it. I didn't want to use any of his stuff yet until the fight, but... Alright, we got this. What level am I, 9? <laughs> level 9? Yeah, we can do this. No problem. The smell. The smelly smell. The smelly smell that smell. So smelly. Must be her. Damn, take a shower, Yukiko. She's right behind this door. Open the door. How you gonna meet your prince when you smell an unky and funky? Yukiko! Can you not scream right in my ear, Chie? Knew it. There's two of her. Oh? Ooh, what's this? Three princes are here to see me. My, my. Are you the surprise guests who came in late? Oh, I wish I'd gotten a better look at you. My, it's getting crowded here. Why don't you and I go somewhere else? Yes, FBI. Those three right there. <laughs> a land far, far away where no one knows me. If you're my prince, you'd take me there, won't you? Come on, pretty please? Man, Yuko, you sound like a gold digger. <laughs> like, for real. When we're gonna go to that trip to Paris, you'll take me there if you love me, right? Oh, is this scoring a hot stud? I think Teddy just went through puberty. Three princes? Wait, does that include me too? Duh, the third one's gotta be me. I seriously doubt that. Chie. <laughs> yes, she's my prince. She always leads the way. Chie's a strong prince. Or at least she was. Damn. Was? <laughs> she got really hurt by that. What do you mean by was? When it comes down to it, Chie's just not good enough. She said it, not me. She can't take me away from here. She can't save me. Yukiko. Stop. Historic Inn? Manager training? I'm sick of all these things chaining me down. I never asked to be born here. Everything's decided for me, from how I live to where I die. I'm so sick of it. To hell with it all. That's not true. I just want to go somewhere far away. Anywhere but here. Someone please take me away. I can't leave here on my own. I'm completely useless. Stop. Please stop. I have no hope if I stay and no courage to leave. 
So I sit on my ass, hoping that someday my prince will come. Damn. <laughs> I don't care where we go. Anywhere's fine. As long as it's not here, I don't give a damn. Historical tradition, pride of the town, what a bunch of bullshit. How dare you? That's how I really feel. Damn, Yukiko, you feel that way? Shit. Isn't that right, me? No. Stop! Don't say it! Please don't say it, Yukiko. You can spare us all the trouble. No! You're not me! Ah, fuck. Wonderful. It's building more and more. If this keeps up, I'll I'll That's very uh it's a nice way to explain that. <laughs> now we repeat that one more time into this camera. <laughs> it's symbolic. in danger i'm in danger motherfucker damn we know it's all right yukiko just hang in there we'll save you all right time to get my ass handed to me <laughs> this is so not gonna go well i am a shadow the true self now my prince why don't we dance and make merry together i always love that line why don't we dance and make merry hang together Then I'll make sure to give you plenty to deal with. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I'll make sure to give you plenty to deal with. Alright, uh, shit. Yeah, we're just... Hmm. I'm just gonna switch up. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Alright, Garu, Sterko Slab, Dekanja, Agi. Hmm, nothing too crazy. Just going for a hit. 32. Oh, fuck. This is gonna take a bit. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, let's see. Yosuke, you got 29 on you. This will surely help out a lot. Maybe, maybe not. Mm-mm. Jesus fuck, Chie. Heal her. Chie Chan's really hurting. Heal her. Yeah, yeah, I know. I got it. Come on, Chie. <laughs> this is so not going to go well. Be a miracle if I pull this shit off. I think she can put up white wall too, right? What? Are you trying to make me mad? Yep, there we go. <laughs> Fuck. All right, so white walls up, which means ah, fucking hell. Gives a passionate stare. Oh, shit. Alright. Not too bad. 43. Chie. How about Yosuke? Ice resistant has been reverted. Double fangs. Fucking Ah, oh, fuck it, fuck. <laughs> we got four of these. Yosuke, make it work. On 
That's your last boofoo you got. Uh -huh. is this our chance? Let's do it. See, the worst part about this is that the prince isn't even here. And we know that's gonna be a problem. Attack reverted. Should we show all right? Ready or not, here we come. Uh, I grow more and more nervous as this goes on. Um, she has a resistance to fire, of course. Damn it. I shouldn't, but I'm going to. Let's see, ninety nine, ninety. She's safe for now with magic wall, at least. Passionate stare. <laughs> I'm gonna be so mad at this heals, Yukiko. <laughs> oh, shit. Yep. Mm, 107. So not good. <laughs> Let's get that back down. Yosuke, can you fucking do me a favor and start dodging? Because that's what you're known for. And I need you to start doing it. Oh, shit. I'll heal my damn self. I might need to power level a little bit more. Ain't no way we're winning this fight. <laughs> like, I'm doing the math in my head right now, and I'm like, there's no fucking way. You keep going for me, by the way. We're not done yet. Show me this strength of yours. Come, my prince. Ah, <laughs> uh, here's the worst part. <laughs> So forget about her. Be his ass. I don't even know what he's weak to. Maybe Garu? Nope, resistant. Maka Jam? Well, guess what? That doesn't help. She has no magic left. I have no magic left either. All I can hope is to get a crit off of you. Ow. Yosuke's in danger. He needs help. Ah, shit. Yep. <laughs> Jesus, fuck. You're gonna miss? Oh, shit. I did not mean to press that button. What does this even do? Cure elements? Who gives a fuck? <laughs> yep, and that's the end of the line. That's checkmate. That is checkmate. Might as well just rush to our deaths. That's not how it's supposed to work. 
You're gonna kill me, it doesn't matter, I'm dead. I don't have enough magic to go through this. There we go. If only if I had enough SP. So I guess we're gonna have to spend two days in the dungeon then. Which I didn't want to do. Life's truth and never a dream. All souls, souls? Wow. All souls know this from birth. The truth is something that's chosen and grasped. Something discovered with one's vision and will. Only by grant. Uh, God damn, I can't read. Only by gaining does a seek become truth itself. Cord, con, blah, 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 blah. You're dead. All right, cool. Fuck. <laughs> you can retry from the floor. Eh. No, it's fine. You know what? I shouldn't have picked retry because that means I'm gonna have to use another go home. Why'd I do that? And why'd I do that? That's not gonna help me at all. Hmm, where's my go homes? There we go. Alright. Welcome back. Return to the entrance. So we're gonna have to spend two days in the dungeon. I didn't want to, but we're gonna have to. God damn it. I right, give it the good old college try. See you later, bye-bye. Even Teddy's sad about it. He's like, damn it, you're really giving up that early? Jesus. Welcome home. Hi, Nanako. I almost died today. You opened the fridge. There's half-eating cup of instant ramen. You left it alone. Damn it. Mm -mm 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 -mm. As of today, you can spend the night in your room. You can also work outside. It doesn't matter what I do because I went to the TV world, right? Yeah, you're tired from the TV world. Go get some rest. Signs of love. Alright. Futon is appearing, blah, blah, blah. Go to sleep. Yep. It's the only thing we can do. You had dreams that you and Yosuke were fucking each other. That's great. Hi. I realize this is sudden, but... Oh no, don't. Don't worry about that. It's always nice to hear your voice, Margaret. I'm Margaret. We met at the Velvet Room the other day. Mm-hmm. There is one important point I forgot to warn you about. So I thought it best to contact you immediately. Going to save your friends is a selfless and noble deed. Oh, I thank you. By all means, we encourage and support you in regards to this matter. But to proceed too hastily in that quest will mean facing one battle after the next. Though you may be pressed for time, devoting yourself to battles will not quench your heart's yearnings. Yeah, I know. The bonds created through social links are another important means of strengthening the powers of your persona. Do not hasten heedlessly through your days, and remember the importance of moving at a sustainable pace. Please remember that. Well then, if you'll excuse me. You took Margaret's advice to heart. You should think carefully about how you spend your days. Yeah, I know, damn it. Yo. Oh, what's up? You got morning practice? You can hear the two walking. Walking? Talking. <laughs> of course you can hear them walking, because you're walking next to them. You know how guys can join the sports club starting today, right? I thought that maybe if I ran around a little, that would be some good promotion. Dude, if you ran around like that, how are people going to know which club you're in? I didn't think about that. And <laughs> that's classic you. I hope our clubs get some fresh blood, too. Let's get everyone excited. Are you guys not going to try and get people to sign up? I don't know about that. Everyone's saying they want a girl to be our manager, though. Oh yeah, let's stop by the shrine in the shopping district on our way home. Might as well pray for some newcomers. You're leaving it up to God now? Well, alright. Oh yeah, did you hear that rumor about the thing that lives in the shrine? I did. I wonder if it's true. Did you hear the rumor about the grumpy old troll who lives under the bridge? Alright, starting today, you can join some clubs. And right off the bat, we're gonna join... The only club that's worth joining- well, not club. The only sport that's worth joining in this game. The best one. Mm. 
All right, where is it? This way. You can go to the gym field from here. Seems clubs practice. You call Eagles words. As you form bonds by becoming involved with others, your own social links will gradually develop. The power of the power of these social links is what will determine your persona's abilities. You wonder if you can create a social link here. Will you join the basketball or soccer club? Let's take a tour first. Yasugami Hi Jim, you watch the basketball team. Nice shot. Alright, let's run some basic drills. Yasugami Highfield, you watch the soccer team. Nice kick. Alright, line up. It's time for everyone's favorite sprints. <laughs> that was he was being facetious. No one likes sprints, they're terrible. All right, we're going to join the basketball club because Daisuke sucks. <laughs> Just like that. Ko is the better one. All right, guys, listen up. Have a new teammate. You all know you Natakami, right? He's from the city. I'm sure he's got some moves he's just waiting to show off. I say the season is in the bag. I even, I even thinking about making him captain. Sounds good to me. Voting is a big pain anyways. Here, why don't you say something to the team? I'm your new captain, bitches. Fall in line. Cool, that takes care of that. The team's goofing around. Well, you guys can take it from here. I gotta go check on the soccer team. You, why don't you just watch why don't you just watch for today? Alright? I'm taking off. The team practiced a little and left. Hey! Oh, he's gonna talk. No, he's not gonna talk. What do you think of your first day here? Or should I say, what'd you think of your first day here? Oh yeah. I'm Ko Ichijo. Second year, same as you. Hey, my name is Ko, <laughs> and I love balls. Want to come wash these balls with me? <laughs> Good to see someone else takes an interest in the team. <sighs> I'm beat. Ko, aren't you done yet? Oh. Yeah, this is the new guy. <laughs> yeah, can you believe it? He's the transfer student. Mm, that's cool. Daisuke Nagase, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Daisuke. Soccer team, second year. Ko and I go way back. Yeah, too far back. I'm getting sick of your face. <laughs> but I like my face. It has a band-aid on it. Hey, did anyone? Did everyone take off early as usual? Yep. I suggest we work on rebounding, but they were all like, that's too tiring. So all we did was take a few shots. But I'm should, I shouldn't scare you away with my bitching on his first day. We got a lot of members who don't show up to practice. But basketball's fun. You played before, right? Eh, I used to play all the time. Nope, never. I suck. <laughs> no problem. I'll work you to the bone. In more ways than one. Wink, wink. If you didn't catch my drift. <laughs> you became friends with Koichi Joe of the basketball team and Daisuke Nagase of the soccer team. You feel a faint bond for me between the three of you. Thou art I, I am thou. Thou has established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the strength arcana. You have established fellow athlete social link of the strength arcana. You may earn an EXP bonus when fusing personas with the strength arcana. Oh yeah, do you know the practice schedule? We meet on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. It's a simple sport, but if you do it right, I'm sure you'll toughen up. Oh, there's no practice on rainy days, by the way, because the other clubs take over the gym. Sometimes it sucks being such a small team. And of course, we don't practice the week before exams. Are you, are you stuck polishing those balls again? Yeah, well, while they go to their parties, I get to stay here and play with balls. Man, I love them balls. Hey, man, you want to go to a party, too? <laughs> I want to go to a party, too. Oh, man. I'll help you. Let's get this done and get out of here. <laughs> I love how the game points out, like, you're an ass if you do this. <laughs> I so want to do it so bad. <laughs> I'll help out. Why not? Fuck it. Huh? You do that? You're a real pal, man. I think I'm tearing up. Ko is exuberant. 
You decided to go home after helping. <laughs> Be an ass and leave. <laughs> All right. It seems Dojima isn't home. That means you can sneak out. Fuck that guy. What does Dojima ever do for me, huh? All right. So nightlife, right? Not much to do. You head to the shopping district. Maybe you'll be able to hang out with your friends. You can head to the shrine. But that's not going to help at this point in time. Or you can... Uh... Oh, shit. I forgot to buy the drinks. Damn it, didn't I? Fuck. You can either come out here, get some of your stats up, right? Let's apply for a job, because we're going to need this. Oh, there's no jobs at the moment. Uh, how much money do we have? 16,000? All right. Nothing we can really do at the shrine. We can hang out with Yosuke and, and company. By in company, I mean just Yosuke, but that's not really going to pay off right now. It might. It might pay off. What we got here? You can raise your knowledge, diligence, understanding, expression, and courage by participating in some activities. Alright, today's special is the Mabu Tofu. Three different types of Mabu Tofu, hot. Raise your courage. I'm trying to think which stat is the most important for us right now. Which one we should really, like, go into with. I would say expression, maybe? Is expression the most important right now? Knowledge, courage. Well, we can get courage pretty easily. Uh, let's see. Actually, let's see the stats right now. How do I check your other stats? Oh, here we go. All right. So let's see. We're average courage, Kaula when it comes to dil diligence. I'm a basic bitch when it comes to understanding. My expression is rough. I have no emotions. And my knowledge is I'm aware. <laughs> I'm not stupid, but I'm aware. All right, let's see. Uh Courage you can get pretty periodically. Diligence we can get that off of the sports, right? Understanding. I'm trying to remember Understanding, understanding and expression. Those are pretty important. I know knowledge is pretty good as well. Uh, so tonight they're doing courage. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go too crazy with courage. I'm trying to think. Uh, what is the best one to go with? Knowledge whenever we can, I guess. And right now, let's just go target understanding and Yo. expression. Yo, you, looks like the fog hasn't set in. Well, let's, let's let's stay on our toes. If we panic and screw up, we're done for. Hey, you want to talk for a while? It's good to have a change of pace every now and then. So, when you hang out with the guys at night, it doesn't... It gives you extra points towards the social link to help progress it, but it won't ever progress through the nighttime events. Always make sure you have the Arcana of the same type with you. Yep. Alright, so what's going on, Yosuke? Man, you're one unlucky guy. As soon as you transfer here, the murder stuff starts. That normally never happens here. In fact, normally normally nothing ever happens here. I love how he's like, yeah, that's that normally ever happens here. Yosuke, you only lived here for a year, buddy. Well, let me know if you find yourself bored. If you don't mind having me around, I'll hang out with you whenever you want. Hmm. What do you go for fun? Hmm. Nowhere comes to mind. The only thing I can think of is Juno's food court. Eh, does that seem like a good place to spend our high school days, though? Still don't know much about you. So tell me, did you bring everything with you from the city? Yeah, when I moved here, it was such a pain unpacking everything. I was using one of the moving boxes as a desk. Oh, I know the feeling, trust me. You enjoyed your idle chat with Yosuke. You feel your relationship with Yosuke has grown stronger. It could become stronger soon. Crap. How long, has we been, how long have we been talking here? We should both be getting home. Oh yeah, here, have this. I heard this is pretty good. You can have this. <laughs> I heard this tastes pretty good, man. Here's a cough drop. We'll see ya. What the fuck, Yosuke? He's like, you ever heard of Halls Hi. before? Got the honey lemon flavor. Here's a cough drop. Want some candy? Yo, you. 
Yeah, my name's you. Hey, you. Hey, I, wa I wanted to ask you. You know how we can enter the TVs now? Have you ever tried sticking your hand in when the TV's on? What I mean is, have you tried touching the screen while the midnight channel's on? I tried it. Oh, ahead of the game. No wonder you're our leader. It's interesting, though. So you couldn't go to the place that was shown on the TV, which means my idea of jumping directly wherever Yukiko is won't work. It seems like it made so much sense, too. But now that I think about it, some more of... Uh, now I think about it some more, of course it wouldn't work. Teddy said, Teddy said where we end up depends on which TV you go into. Although every TV seems to be the same thing on the midnight... I... Sorry, what? <laughs> Although every TV sees the same thing on the midnight channel, that seems sort of contradictory. Well, looks like we got to suck it up and march straight into the castle. But we can't really complain. Yukiko-san has it worse than us. Sure about that, Yosuke? Maybe you should try it. There's actually a moment in a uh, Persona 4 Arena. What the fuck was that sound? Hold up, did something just disconnect? All right, <laughs> all right, all right. Settle down. Now class is now in session. Now class is now set. Whatever. My name is Mr. Hoshi, and in this class you'll be learning about contemporary writing. Let's all have fun. I know this is off topic, but what's the point of applying for colleges outside of Inaba? Why even bother? Nothing good ever comes from competing with city folk. The countryside is all you need. Well, since this is our very first lesson, why don't you show me how much you already know? Now then, how many parts are there in Mark Markame's The Wind Up The Wind Up what? The Wind Up Bird Chronicle. Hanachan, I'm calling on you. I get the feeling you're not much of a reader. Hey, I read. I mean not books, but Oh, you come on, help me out here. There are three. You gave him the answer you think is correct. Very good, Hanachan. Either you're more literate, uh, literate. Oh God, even you're more literary than you look, or that's what, a, or that was a lucky guess. The Wind Up Bird Chronicle was released as three separate stories. It's the eighth of its twelfth published books. Wait, what? Three stories, it's the eighth of the pu okay, eighth of the published from the author. Got it. Its latest book was 1Q84. It was published in 2009. The first print uh, the first printing sold out on the very first day of sale. And of course, that's not counting all his short stories and essays, which I don't even have time to get into right now. Phew, you're a lifesaver. You thanks. Yosuke appreciates you. He you better. Your expression has increased. He gave a hint of a smile. Class is ended for today. The fog will come in several days. It is Wednesday, so the sports team should not be able to meet up. Uh, Yosuke wants to hang out. We can increase his stuff. After the promise. Still I get, still I get. Oh, baby, I need you. Alright. I think we can... Maybe on a Thursday? Can it be on a Wednesday? Let me see. We're gonna join the drama club, by the way. Maybe you should try and join. Wait, what? You should visit when you're able to join. So there are two uh, extracurricular activities to take part in. It's drama club and band. And I'm just gonna tell you right now, drama club is way better than band. Just don't don't even do band. Don't even look at band. Band is terrible. Don't look at it. <laughs> Drama club and band club. Houses to the most horniest of teens you'll ever meet in your life. <laughs> Why is that? Why are the band kids and the drama kids always like super horny? What's with that? <laughs> Why have the stars aligned that way? Yeah, let's go. Yo! Am I tired? Rushing into things isn't gonna help, you know? How about we take a little break? Maybe you should hang out with Yosuke and relax. I'll hang out with you, okay? Right. Shopping district. So, Sozai, I don't, I don't even know. Sozai Dai, Daigaku? The famous steak croquettes are tough. <laughs> Sticking chunks of stick, steak inside croquettes, man. It really is country, huh? It's super country because they made it well done. <laughs> they burnt that shit. Eating hockey pucks. Well, is it good? Tough is tough. 
Oh, tough as stuff. Though it's tough, <laughs> tough as stuff. Those words are too similar. Tia calls this stuff tender and juicy. What kind of teeth does she have? Fucking dinosaur biting into meat. You can hear the woman's conversation. He's from Junez Yosugami High School, right? His classmate, Sato-san, went out of business. This shopping district could disappear, and yet... <laughs> Sorry about that. You know me, I'm infamous around here. Mm, must be tough. Why are you infamous? Eh, must be tough, man. No, it's not really. It's mainly my parents, I'm not personally involved. Anyways, there's nothing I can do about it. I don't think there's anyone in Inaba who doesn't know me, at school or around town. Not that I mind, but it sucks that I always gotta mind my manners. Yosuke smiles cheerfully. You feel, uh, understand- Oh, God damn it! You feel you understand Yosuke a bit more. My brain's melting. The Yosuke Hanamura social link has reached level 2. <laughs> Your growth- Growth of a heart has affected his persona as well. He learned Terafuri. Terafuri? I don't fucking know. It lets you leave the dungeon. You don't need to go home. Level up social links, you get more EXP when fusing personas. Still, this croquette its damn good, huh? I'm gonna have another. You want one too, right? Okay, let's head home. Great croquettes with Yosuke until your stomach started to bulge. Then you went home. Aww. Hi, Nanako. We're back. Anything in the fridge for me? Nope, nothing. Thanks. Thanks for nothing, Nanako. I'm sorry, Nanako. I didn't mean to be be mean towards you. You're my favorite. You're everyone's favorite. Every day is great when Nanako's around. All right, let's see. Anyone I can hang out with at nighttime, right now? Chie. Fuck. I keep forgetting. Damn it. I keep forgetting, I gotta buy soda for the damn kid so he can hmm? give me bugs. Hey, do you mind if we talk for a bit? I get all ancient when I'm back home. Oh shit, hold up. Hold up, hold up, Jay. Hold that thought. I gotta go get a chariot persona. <laughs> I gotta milk you for what you're worth, Jay, you know what I mean? Every last bit of Chie juice. <laughs> I think I have chariot, right? It's a uh, slime? Slime should be Chariot. Lover's Chariot. Slime. Only cost me 2,000 bucks to hang out with Chie. Alright. I am back, Chie. I have returned with a vengeance. Yeah. Let's hang out. I bet you don't know much about this place, seeing as how you just transferred and all. Well, it's not much to know. The only thing I can think of is, uh... How much nature we have here? But the people are really nice. Like, if you lose your wallet, it'll definitely come back to you. And if you're ever in a fix, you can always count on me. Hmm. Chie? Where do you like to eat? <laughs> I recommend Aya. And, uh, and Suzai. Suzai? I, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Aya's steak bowls are delicious, and Suzai's steak screws are great, too. Honestly, I don't recommend steak no matter... Wait, what? I don't. <laughs> Honestly, I recommend steak no matter where in Japan. Chie is passionately talking about steak. Most restaurants here close real early, but Aya stays open late. I keep getting lured in by the delicious smell from inside. You enjoyed your idle chat with Chie. You feel your relationship with Chie has grown stronger. You feel your relationship with Chie has become stronger. Or well, will become stronger, I don't know. Well, how long have we been talking? I got so, I got, I got so caught up in the conversation. Oh yeah, I want you to have this. From me to you. A corn, a corn postage cracker, what? This is my number one recommendation lately. You should try it. Well, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get going. She walked Chie to her house. That's cool. Alright, daytime. Gotta remember. Fuck, it's raining. <laughs> Yo! What do you want, Yosuke? I hear there's gonna be sunny for a while starting this afternoon. Looks like we're not gonna have to worry about the fog for now. 
The fog always sets in around the mornings after it's rain for a few days. Uh, we'll keep watching the forecast then. Right, I'm counting on you, leader. Of course you're counting on me. You're all counting on me. That's all you do is count on me. Yo, you! You know, we got practice today. You coming to practice, man? I'll think about it. Alright. First of all, let's head into goddamn town. <laughs> let's do that! Um... Chesrol Shopping District. Alright. First things first, sell you everything I got. Now he's gonna start making some shit. <laughs> Alright, cool. I have 20,000. I'm not worried about the weapon right now, I'm worried about the defense. Chainmail, still... Alright, that's still all we got. Imitation Katana, Longsword, from 53 to 60. Oh, I thought I had these for you already, Chie. My bad, I'm sorry. Would you like to sell those? And this costs 10,000. Man, you're making me broke already. Fuck. Accessories. Chie. Let's try magic. SP, HP, 10. All right. Mm-mm-mm-mm. All right, nothing too crazy. Just gave Chie some, uh... Whatchamacallit? Some of that goodness. <laughs> Shit. So there's that. I did not mean to head to the shop. I barely buy anything here, actually, so what do you have to sell? Go home, vanish balls, ice cracker, pain balls, and medicine. Value medicine. I guess I'm gonna have to start buying medicine, right? Oh, I feel so bad spending money in this game. Mm. Six. Six medicines, please. Oh, I don't like it. I'm so not used to it. Spending money in a Persona game. Uh, I can't sign up for, um... Yeah, there's no jobs right now. Alright, cool. Uh, head to the shrine. Which you want to do. Right now. So we can prepare this for later. Catching bugs make me hungry. I want a steak skewer, you piece of shit. You want to feed that kid. So he can give you a bug. You want to do this at least twice, I think. Alright, you little fucking monster. Apparently your mother didn't feed you breakfast this morning. To me, Ladybug. Alright, cool. I'm gonna hold on to that until nighttime. Right? Uh, so today we can hang out with the. We hang out with Sports Club. Uh, practice building. I just wanna check. I'm not sure if they tell you when you're able to join the uh, drama club and stuff like that, but I just wanna check. Yeah, okay. I guess they'll tell me when I'm able to do that. So we can hang out with the sports team. Right? And that's it, really. I don't think we can hang out with Chie or anything like that. Can we hang out with Chie? Chie, are you... Are you in here? No, we can't hang out with Chie. Okay, cool. If we can hang out with Chie, she'll be chilling on the roof. Yo. Hey, you, you're going to practice, right? Yep. Sweet. Let's give it our best shot. Fuck, I didn't have a Persona of the Strength Arcana. Shit. I forgot about that. Fuck. I'm so used to having Personas on me. You attend the basketball practice. Your diligence has increased. Man, I'm hungry. Hey, you. Aya or Junez? I go to Junez all the fucking time. Take me to Aya. 
Oh, you really know what's up? Their high guru is something awesome. It's very awesome. See a gleam in Ko's eyes. Huh. Hey, Ko, hurry up. Hey. The soccer team's done already? You guys are fast, man. Don't you have cleaning up to do? <laughs> yeah, but I don't have to do that stuff. Hmm. Oh, yeah, this girl from my class was looking for you. She made something for you in home ec. She said, Kochan loves sweets or something like that. Hmm. Well, I do like me some sweets. Man, I am jealous. No, no, we're just friends. <laughs> I don't mind the sweets and all that, but I wish she stopped calling me Kochan. I swear, the more girls I tell not to call me that, the more they seem to enjoy doing it. I hate my name, Ko. Such a crappy name. Well, what are you gonna do? I guess I'll go pick him up. You like sweets, you? Want me to get you some, too? Fuck yeah! <laughs> if I mention you, I bet she'll give me tons. She's such a whore. <laughs> she just horn herself out with cookies. Alright, leave it to me. I'll get us so much candy, we'll be too fat to practice. Your relationship with Ko seems to be grown stronger. Would have grew even better if you had a strength Arcano persona, but you don't. The fellow athlete social link has has reached level two. I'm off. Hey Daisuke, you don't leave without me, all right? If you're not here when I get back, I'm gonna cry. Funny thing is, he's probably serious. All right, let's go home. You wait for Ko and stop by a few places together before going home. Hi, Nanako. The rain stopped. Thanks for telling me, Nanako. It's not like I just walked in from the outside. <laughs> Alright, so, what you want to do at night with that wonderful bug that we grabbed? Because we got to start setting things in motion for later. Um, gonna run over here. Head over here. Ah, welcome. I turn my store into a midnight club, once normal business hours are over. I met you before during the day. Well, that doesn't matter. This is a nocturnal oasis for adults, where they can escape their daily lives and gather in search for a moment of peace. And I'm a, be I'm a beautiful butterfly of the night, adored with gems who flutter down to bask in the oasis glow. Everything you see and hear here is only a dream. It's a no-no to drag what happens here into the light of day. Remember that. Now I'm sure you understand that this is no place for a child like you. It's time for you to go home. Hmm? Wait a second. What's that? You seem to have something quite impressive with you. Those beautiful shiny stones, of course. <laughs> Won't you trade them with me? I always imagined her as a smoker lady. <laughs> Just the deep voice, right? Uh, hey, won't you listen to my troubles? I have, a I have a little one named Akihiko. But lately, it seems no matter what food I offer him, he refuses to eat. Or is it because I have a night job? Or could it be that he realizes that I'm not his real mother? Oh dear. I'm so worried lately that I can't even sleep at night. You run a fucking... What? <laughs> you run a bar at night, lady. The fish in the tank suddenly begins to swim about in a lively manner. Huh? Akihiko, what's wrong? It seems he wants to eat that lovely Tatsumi ladybug you have with you. Please, won't you let my little one eat your bug? <laughs> he won't eat the breadcrumbs I give him at this rate, he'll... Please, my little one's the only emotional support I have. I'm begging you. Give her the Tsumi ladybug? Yeah, sure, why not? Thank you. You're so kind. I wouldn't mind if you attempt to flirt with me right now. <laughs> it's only a little joke. Don't take everything so seriously. Now here's your dinner, Akihiko. Hostess puts Tsumi ladybug in fish tank. Something came out of the fish's mouth. My god, this is a fish hook, Akihiko. Where'd you eat something like this? 
So my boy had a fish hood stuck in his throat. That was, that's why he seemed so down. Thank goodness. I'm sure he'll get better now. Thank you so much. You obtained the fish hook. I'm glad you're all better now, Akihiko. Here, have some breadcrumbs. Make sure to chew 20 times before swallowing. The fish in the tank completely ignores the breadcrumbs. Sheesh. Now that he's all better, he's getting carried away and making extravagant demands. <laughs> I know a man like that wants to. Do you want some breadcrumbs? I'll give them to you if you want. I'll give you more breadcrumbs if you bring me more Tatsumi ladybugs for my little one. Alright, cool. Now here you can exchange stones for some nifty items. Right? But over time you'll probably not want these. <laughs> over time anyways. You'll end up getting better stuff so you'll end up just selling stones. So that's what you want to do with that Tatsumi ladybug. You want to do that a second time because we're gonna need, we're gonna need it to do that again. Um, anything we can do here at night, right now? I don't think so. I don't think so. No. Okay. Cool. I'm gonna head to the velvet room. I want to see if I have. Uh, I want to see what Karna. Uh, what Arcana? Can't speak. I want to see what Arcanas I have available to me with these personas. Check the compendium. I will do that. View the compendium. By level. Uh, change display to the ones that we have only. So we have temperance. We have no money too. We don't have strength. So that's going to be a problem. <laughs> that's going to be a problem. Uh, temperance is something we're going to need. Devil we're going to need. Justice we're going to need. Oh shit. I'm going to grab temperance right now. Because I know we're going to need that. Uh, magician. Da, 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 da. No, I think we're good for now. So, as of right now, I guess we can ignore the strength arcana. A uh, social link. I don't want to ignore it, though. <laughs> I really don't. Alright. Um, head back home. When there's nothing else to do at night, you can either go to the shrine, which is not available to us yet, go to sleep, or do something that I like to do, which will definitely help us out. Head upstairs. Oh shit, what's going on here? Hello, it's Yosuke. You want to go and set TV tomorrow? I know you have other stuff to do, but I think about exploring too. Yeah, I know, Yosuke. I'm using my time wisely, okay? Head over here to your desk. Start studying. This is going to take a long time. <laughs> gonna take forever to get that up so you want to be diligent with that all right <sighs> morning you it rained yesterday but there still wasn't any sign of fog setting in looks like the weather will still stay normal at least for a little while so don't think the rain will be any problem for us hey do you ever have nights where you're so nervous that you can't get to sleep I sleep well every night. <laughs> yeah, I understand. <laughs> you too? I'm glad to know I'm not the only one. Anyways, let's stay calm and on our toes. Alright. So with that said... It is a Friday. We shouldn't have anything to do. Right? We can hang out with Yosuke, but I'll pass on that one for now. I'm not too worried about that. Uh, we can also hang out with Marie. We have to do that at some point. But as of right now, I think... I think it'll be a nice time to head into the TV world. Every day it's great at your Junas. Alright, um, we have medicines on us. We have... Uh, Chie has a boot. <laughs> Better boots now. Uh, nothing too fancy. Yosuke has his thing going on, and alright, cool. We should be able to beat Yukiko, and if we don't, I'm gonna be very sad, and I'm not gonna return to the real world until we do. Because we already, I already went over my one day limit.
Hey there, you. Let's play. Huh? No time? Oh yeah, that's right. You guys gotta save the girl. Alright. Mm -mm. mm -mm. There we go. Rotate those saves. Alright. Uh, we're gonna head straight to the castle. Alright, Yukiko. Get ready. Now we're at full health, we should be able to do it. It's gonna it's gonna take some time, but we should be able to do it. I'll send out an SOS, by the way, just in case. Alright. So we've seen this all before. I'm gonna skip it. It's not like Persona 5, though, where you just press a button and it skips everything. I wish it was. They should have made it like that. Alright, there we go. I am a shadow, the true self. Now, my prince, why don't we dance and make merry together? Hang in there, Yukiko! I'm right here for you! Oh, really? Then I'll make sure to give you plenty to deal with. Alright. Now that we're feeling fine and better. Let's do that. Yosuke, just go for some regular attacks. Come on, Yosuke! What the fuck, man? Uh, I would Terry Kaja, but honestly... I'd rather just go off the, uh... The bonus that we're getting right now. I don't have the other one equipped, do I? <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, what are you again? Yeah, you don't have Rakunda, so... Uh, well, I just used Rakunda, so it's really no difference to me right now. Uh, Agi, Garu. Garu won't help against you. Well, it will, probably, because you're good with magic, right? 80. I'll take it. Yosuke? Thank you. Let's go, Tomoe. Here's a do it. Give it up. Just waiting for that prince to show up. What? Are you trying to make me mad? White wall. Alright, there we go. Uh I'll go with Garu. Get that in there. Same thing with the Yosuke, you can do that. Now I'll buff you. Uh, we should be fine. Alright, not too bad. Uh... Switch up the Persona. Throw your Rakunda. Yosuke. I can Garu, but just to be safe. We're still pretty weak. Alright. Uh, I'm not gonna use your HP. Need to conserve every bit that we have. You got a critical. Son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, fuck. The only thing I didn't see coming, huh? Jesus. That. That just put me in a mood. That just made me mad. Oh, wow. The critical. Really. Really. If things, if things become too rough, 
then I'll grind for like two more levels, right? But Jesus fuck, you gotta be kidding me with that. <laughs> Talk about lucky. Uh-huh. I died to Yuhiko three times. This is the most times I ever died to this fucking... This goddamn bird. Mm -mm -mm. Jesus. Ooh. Nice dodge. Man, Yukiko, you really seem to have, like, a fucking hard-on for me, to be honest. Because you're just coming after me over and over and over again. <laughs> Wall. I don't want to switch my persona because I think she's just gonna fucking attack me. <laughs> fucking a oh, critical. You gotta be kidding me. Make it last longer. Uh, let's do this because what the fuck, man. <laughs> Uh, white wall is up for you, so I'm gonna... I'll buff myself. Passionate stare. That's fine. Uh, switch out. Garu. Your white wall is still up. Uh, just regular attack. Agi. Yosuke's in danger. He needs help. That's fine. I got you, Yosuke. Do I got you, Yosuke? Can I just... No, Yosuke, you can get your fucking self. <laughs> Fuck you. Don't worry, Teddy, I got it. Attack revert it. Damn, that really didn't last long. Huh, not worth it. Now the prince should show up. Nope, not yet. Can you get off my back, woman? Jesus. I gotta make sure I'm healthy because apparently, whatchamacallit, Double Fang is just gonna ruin my life. Her defense has been reverted, so I'm not going to worry too much about her right now. This is kind of dangerous, what I'm doing right now. Fucky, fucky, fuck, fuck, fuck. Uh, Rakunda on the Prince. I think he's resistant to, uh, ice? I'm just going to do this just in case she decides to double thing the shit out of me. I think you're weak to ice. If not, then you're weak to fire. Miss. Son of a bitch. You missed too. White wall? Alright, cool. Uh, Switch it up. 
Let me see, you might be weak to fire. Ooh, 105. Uh, I know you're resistant to Garu, so... There we go. Ice. Really? Do you not have a weakness? Evil touch. Yeah, of course. Mmm. Sorry, Yosuke. Yosuke's hurt! Someone do something! Ah, oh, damn it. You gotta be serious. You gotta be fucking kidding me. You know his weakness? Is it- is it really- is it electric? Fuck off. <laughs> is it electricity? Damn it. Ah, oh, She's gonna make me switch. She has white wall up right now, so it's not really worth it. Alright, here's what's gonna happen. Yosuke, touch yourself. We're gonna wait until her bullshit wears off. Miss, 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 miss. Fuck. Of course. Hey, okay, Sensei, someone heal him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, I got medicines. There we go. Chi-chan can't use her persona. Yeah, I know. That double thing is deadly. I am under level for this. <laughs> Super under level. Defense reverted. Not too worried about it. Passionate stare. Oh, that's such a gamble. I'm not gonna risk it. Chi Chan can't use her persona. You're a bastard. <laughs> I hate you. Oh, that hurt. All right, this is gonna not be good. What I'm about to do. Please don't miss. I'll cry. There we go. Nice moves, partner. Uh. All right, there we go with that. Heal me up, damn it, please. I should have gave you a medicine. Chie has recovered just in time. Damn, it's so not worth it. Chi Chan can't use her persona. Did something just happen with Twitch? I'm sorry. Wait, I gotta take a moment of pause here. Did something just happen with Twitch? Because I saw, like, I usually don't pay attention to it, but the viewer count went down and then spiked way back up. <laughs> it like went to zero for a hot second. Did Twitch, like, freak out? Or am I freaking out? Alright, well, now... Now that I did that stupid shit... Um... Didn't I hit you for, like, a hundred something with Augie? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. My health is pretty low, so is Joe's guys. Uh, thanks you're lurking or something? No, it counts lurkers. It only doesn't count bots. I don't know why I healed Chie. I don't know why I did that. She's not... She helps, but she's not super important to the equation. Get that fucking prince. I'm gonna argue that motherfucker. Uh, Yosuke's looking pretty low. Che has recovered. Ha ha! My prince! My dear prince! Now with him out the way, you're a piece of... piece Why? of cake. Why won't he come? <laughs> no one's coming! Now's your chance to attack! 
man, that's uh, those two things. Sounds like my ex. <laughs> Why? Why won't he come? Oh, no one's coming. Now's the time to attack. All right. Um, she still has her defense down. Yeah. Yes. And her white wall reverted. I think it did. Uh, Yosuke, you still got a shit ton of magic. You still don't have White Wall up, do you? Ah, oh, you do. Fuck. Chie Damn it, Chie! This isn't good. You know what's not good? What I'm about to do. It's gonna be bad. It's gonna be bad. I think she's gonna try and summon her prince again. At some point. It's not good. I'm having a heart attack right now. Yosuke! Chie! Uh oh. Are you okay, Sensei? Woo. Someone heal him. Woo, put that back on. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Fuck you. Get that in there. Sensei, mind your health, okay? Yeah, I know, Teddy. Listen, I'm I'm shitting myself over here, all right? Terror voice. Ah, shit. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Should I throw a Garu in there? It'll do damage. All I know is I'm not doing any more fucking Rakundas. <laughs> that last one was a close call. <laughs> Paralyzed with fear. That's fine, Yosuke. That's fine. As long as Yosuke doesn't run away from battle, right? White wall. That's fine. Snap out of it, Yosuke. Come on. Damn it. Yosuke's scared. I should be fucking scared. All right. Uh, she's definitely gonna go after Chie. I feel it in my bones. Thank you. I think this might be the part where she stops warning me about her fire attack, by the way. Her burn to ashes. Why did I do that? No, I'm just terror voice. Man, you really hate Yosuke. <laughs> you really hate Yosuke. <laughs> Alright. That's all I got left. Hmm. Really, Chie? Oh. Nice job. Yosuke scared. Chie, watch out. Nice. It's cornered. You're nearly there. I know I'm nearly there, okay? Yosuke, help out. Damn it. Chie, come on. All right, guys. Okay. This is it. Oh, no. Chie Chan's in danger. He Attack Yosuke, not me. Attack Yosuke, That's not me. That's not how it's supposed to work. You have to escort me. Okay, White Wall. I'll take that. Yosuke barely has any health. Man, yo, fuck Yosuke, who cares? 
What about me? Up we go. Uh, who should I heal you? Ah, uh, yes, yeah. I'm gonna need you, Che. I really am. So, uh, there you go. Thank you. Um, should I guard? I feel like I should guard. No, she can go for Yosuke. <laughs> like always. She's like, stop with that healing shit. Damn, Yosuke, dodge it. Mm. I got him, don't worry. I got him, I got him, I got him. <laughs> got him. Damn it, Yosuke. Yosuke's like, why me all the time? So unlucky with the ladies. Nice job. Woo. Fuck. Felt the surge of energy inside you. Level 10. <laughs> attacking weakness, attacking Yosuke. <laughs> Man, Yukiko, you're a bitch. Yukiko! Yukiko, are you hurt? No, I'm not. Please, God, don't say it no more. After that shit we just pinned through. We understand. You're not the only one like that, Yukiko-san. Everyone has something they can't show to other people, or don't want to admit to themselves. Yukiko, I'm sorry. I was so self-centered that I never understood what you were going through. I'm your friend. And I still... I'm so sorry. Chie. I was always jealous of you, Yukiko. You had everything that I didn't. That jealousy was like a wall, and I was so lonely. I wanted you to need me. But it was me who needed you. I can't do anything right on my own. I've caused so much trouble for Yosuke and the others. If you weren't by my side, I... I wouldn't know what to do. Chie. I never saw the real you, either. I was too busy trying to find an easy way out. I want to run away. I want someone to save me. You're right. Those feelings are part of me, too. I understand now. You're me. The strength of heart... <laughs> Shit, I can't read. The strength of heart required to face oneself has been made manifest. Yukiko has faced her other self. She has obtained the facade used to overcome life's hardships. The persona, Konohana, Konohana Sakuya. I knew I was going to fuck it up somehow. <laughs> it's a cool ass name though. I like it. Yukiko! Damn, Yukiko, I know you're used to being on your knees, but get up, girl! Are you okay? Yes, I'm just a little tired. You all came to rescue me. Of course! Thank you. <laughs> Don't even mention it. I'm just so glad you're safe! <laughs> right on. Right on, man! <laughs> like, right on, man! <laughs> Shaggy ass so, motherfucker. Who threw you in here? Oh, I forgot you were here, Teddy. Huh? Who are you? Rather, what are you? I'm Teddy. So who threw you in? I don't know. I think someone called my name. But my memory is a blur. I can't remember who it was. I'm sorry. Um, Teddy? No new clues. Not necessarily. Now we know for sure that someone threw Yukiko-san in here. Hmm. Then it really isn't you guys. What the fuck, man? Of course not. You still, you still suspecting me? <laughs> no, 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 
no, no, no. Absolutely not. Dude, I just got my ass lit on fire and you still thought I was the murderer? Smart guy. You little... You're one lying sack of honey. Anyways, let's hurry back home. Yukiko looks exhausted. Thanks again, Teddy. And now with that, the Scooby-Doo gang has been forged. Wait, you're leaving me here? <laughs> you got the two boys, the two girls, and the weird creature. Leaving you? What are you talking about? You live here. Well, yeah, but... I'm sorry, Teddy. I promise to come again. So be a good boy and wait here until then. It was Yukiko's fault. She started. She started it. She started it. This is why Teddy's the way he is. She gave into his demands. My, it's getting crowded here. Why don't you and I go somewhere else? Come on. Pretty please? That's the creepiest shit I ever heard in my life. <laughs> Come on. Pretty please? I promise there's no roofies in your drink. Ah, you're giving me the creeps. That's it. You're stuck here for the rest of your life. Teddy's totally the guy who would roofie someone, right? And then just, and just like fucking laugh it off. <laughs> like 100%. Yukiko, are you alright? You're not hurt anywhere, are you? Man, eh, fuck if Yukiko is hurt. She just laid down there. My ass got lit on fire. No, I'm just a little tired. All right, so uh, you remember anything? I'm sorry, but I don't remember anything. I don't remember, but I remember. Well, no worries. You're safe, and that's more than enough. Not for me. But there's no mistake that Yukiko-san was... Um, attacked the same way as the last two victims. And I think the one we saw on the Midnight Channel wasn't the real Yukiko-san, but her shadow. Maybe the things Yukiko-san was suppressing in this world took form in the TV. You know, Teddy was saying something like that. <sighs> it's no use. I'm just going round and round in circles. What kind of person could be doing this? A magician. Uh, let's call it a day. I am tired. You're worried about Yukiko's condition right now. Your understanding has increased. Yeah, we can go over it some other day. Yukiko really needs to get some rest. I'll take her home. Oh, that's right. Sorry. Yukiko-san must be exhausted. We'll talk about all this some more once she gets her strength back. You were able to rescue Yukiko safely, but this case mystery has been has been deepened even further. For now, you should wait for Yukiko to recover. We did it. Sucks I wasn't able to do it in one day though. I wanted to really badly. Um, hello. I love her. her enthusiasm just shot way down. She's like, Dad's home. Who the fuck is that? We got off work at the same time, so I'm giving him a ride back to his place. I thought we might as well swing by. Nice to meet you. I'm Adachi, the guy who's been your dad's slave since spring. I can still work you harder, you know. Hey. <laughs> hey, yo. Hey. <laughs> a good one, sir. <laughs> He said, I can still bend you over harder. <laughs> Alright, let's move on. Oh, I almost forgot. You're friends with Yukiko Amagi, right? They found her safe and sound. Tell all your friends at school. That's cool, man. Man, we owe you a lot. Good job. Oh, thanks. Wow, someone thanked me for a job well done. I don't know what to say. So, I want to point out that between these, uh, <laughs> between these streams, I've been starting to watch Twin Peaks, right? I watched it before, but I never really paid attention to it, so I'm watching it now. And, uh, I forgot what the officer's name is. I think his name's Andy? I'm getting a lot of Andy feelings from Adachi right now. <laughs> but, this doesn't mean the case is closed, though. We were just questioning Miss Amagi, but she says she doesn't remember anything that happened while she was missing. And we can't figure out her whereabouts during the missing period either. It's like she really disappeared. It's all pretty fishy if you ask me. Like there's something else going on. Ow! Stop blabbering, dumbass. 
sorry. She's beating up Adachi in front of the kids. Ignore him. Just I hate it when mommy and daddy fight. Oh, Alright. I'll forget it then. Yeah, don't give it a second thought. Sheesh. He's a real pain sometimes. I'm hungry. <laughs> You're right. My stomach's growling too. <laughs> so you do have a softer side around Nanako. Why did it take him like a good minute to say that line? <laughs> like I stood there for a moment. I was like, wait a minute. Why is it so quiet? Shut up and sit down. And wash those hands first. Hm. I should do the same. Dinner promises to be lively for once, instead of three sad sacks just being fucking sitting there in silence. Now we're gonna have four sad sacks sitting there in silence. Would you like to save your progress? Yes, fucking please. I'll make sure that we don't run into that problem like we did with Yukiko ever again. <laughs> You ever hear students talking? Hey, did you hear? There's some part-time jobs listed in town's bulletin board now. I wish there was one that would let me make some quick cash. I don't think you have the diligence to handle jobs that take a lot of time. That's so mean. Maybe I don't, but I bet I'd be more diligent if I did a job. <laughs> I bet I'd be more diligent if I get a job and pay bills. Let me tell you something. As a working adult, myself, you don't become more diligent. If anything, you cry when you wake up and have to go to work. I bet you wouldn't do too well with a job where you have to work with others because you lack understanding, huh? I don't need to work. Since I'm focusing on my studies, if my grades are good, I might be able to swing a raise in my allowance. That's cheating. I wish I was born to a rich family, so I didn't need a part-time job. Or if I knew someone nice enough to buy me anything I wanted. <laughs> what if I just whore myself out? <laughs> I don't think that would be, I don't think that would be too great. There's someone like that in our school too. Wait, what? Oh, I don't think that wouldn't have been so great. Someone like in our uh, shit, I can't read. Someone like that in our school too. Oh, huh? Hmm? That's interesting. Well then, I'll begin my lecture on the Age of Discovery, which occurred between the 15th and 17th century. Many types of vegetation were introduced to Europe during this era. Among them, tulips from Turkey deserve special attention. Gardening for pleasure was becoming popular because of, because of the pricing of tulip bulbs. Oh shit. Causing the pricing of tulip bulbs to rise. It was the wor world's first economic bubble incident. Tulip mania. Along with the South Sea bubble and the Mississippi Company. It is said to be one of the biggest bubbles in European history. Hey, Mr. Hanamura, wake up. What was the first economic bubble incident of the world? Huh, what? Help you? What is this economic bubble shit she's talking about? Tulip mania, ma'am. Everyone goes crazy for the tulips. Ah, so you were listening. Yes, it was tulip mania. Tulip bulbs imported into Holland became extremely popular and prices jumped dramatically as a result. At its highest, a single bulb was worth the price of a luxurious house. Bulb? Bulb? I keep saying bulb. I don't know. It's a weird word, you know? However, once the bubble burst, prices fell once again, and the trade cities in Holland were thrown into confusion. Mr. Hanamura, do take care not to let that snot bubble of yours burst. Ew, that's gross. <laughs> or you may also be thrown into confusion. I'm not making it snot bubbles. Anyways, I was right, wasn't I? But yeah, thanks you. I'll have to stay awake for the next one. Yosuke appreciates you. He gives you a handy under the table. Your expression has increased. Alright. First things first, it is a Saturday. <laughs> All right, head to the shrine. Talk to the kid, see what the fuck he wants. Second maid. Second maid, Jesus. Second maid, more like bitch maid. Ha ha. Uh, let's see. Second maid. I'm surprised I got the right one on the first try. 
You won a prize. You get another one. Give me that Dr. Salt Neo. Hey! Give me the natural. Hey! I want some more of that second maid, baby. I'm the king of drinks! Oh my fucking god. <laughs> I'm the king of drinks, baby! Some may call me the drink king. Here you go, you little bitch. It's me, Ladybug. Now, while we're out here, you also want to head over. And I think we need to buy ourselves a skewer just, just to get ahead of the game. Can I buy another one? Alright. Nope. That's fine. Oh, bulletin board. Almost forgot. So we can grab jobs, right? Uh, the three on the first one aren't crazy important, just stuff you can do at home, so you want to just pick those up. You don't have to worry about any type of schedule or nothing like that, just do it whenever you see fit. And, assistant daycare, take this job. Alright, the bus in the shopping district to the, uh, shopping district to the hill overlooking town, or not, whatever. Oh, my bad. So, when it's not raining, you can do daycare work on Mondays, Friday, and Saturday, I believe. When it's not raining, and I think during summer vacation you can't do it, I'm not sure. Uh, over here, we want to grab ourselves... Um, expert study methods. That's going to help us in the long run. Uh, and since it is Saturday, and I believe we do have a Temperance Arcana, it doesn't matter if you have the Persona right now or not. We're gonna head here. Gonna do that job we just took. You're introduced to the children as an assistant take, uh, as a sensitive caretaker. The children are extremely interested in you. Mister, you got a girlfriend? Don't ask him that, you creep. Let's play tag, mister. You're it. You survived the children's tugging you in every direction. Your understanding has increased. There is one boy remaining. It seems his guardian has come, hasn't come to pick him up. How are things, Yukun? Has everyone been picked up? Looks like you, Takun, is still here. It's always like this, though. Oh, you coon. Hi, you coon. I'm sorry I'm late. Whatever. He fucking runs like Woody from Toy Story. Are you one of the supervisors? I see. Thanks for taking care of him. I'm sure you coon will cause you trouble again, but please take care of him. Yuta Min Minami? Minami. He's full of energy during his play sessions, maybe too much energy. But once she arrives, he's a totally different kid. She's a stepmother, so I guess it can't be helped. Bow chicka wow wow. <laughs> That's what you kids like, huh? The stepmother thing? <laughs> my stepmo- My mother and her multi-hitting attacks. Yutakun's father got remarried to that woman you just met. I heard she's from the city. I really don't know what she's thinking. Perhaps that's why you took him. It's a troublemaker at school, too. The other day, he... The caretaker continues gossiping. Talking shit about a kid? Damn, lady, you probably got nothing else better to do in your life. You finished your job helping at the daycare center and went home. You earn 4,000 bucks. 4,000 yen, to be precise. It's not bucks. Don't get crazy. That's like the equivalent of what? What? $40? <laughs> Around $40? Maybe like $43? Alright. Um, it is nighttime, which we want to head back to the bar for a quick second. So that we may... We may grab ourselves more, um... More fish crumbs. More fishy fishies. Ow. 
I call the fresh crumbs, bread crumbs, that's what they're called. <laughs> Alright, talk to her. Give her to Tsumi Ladybug. And there you go. That's all we need for now from her. Um, and because there's nothing for us to do at night yet, I'm not going to worry about the... I'm not going to worry about the, um, hanging out with the friends at nighttime shit yet. We can always make up for that later. I am going to take my, I'm going to scootle my little boodle upstairs after I save this game. We're going to do that. Alright, and we're going to start reading Expert Study Methods. You begin reading Expert Study Methods. The book contains tips on how to concentrate during class and take notes effectively in order to increase knowledge retention. Though, while reading it, you wonder if it really is easy to follow all the, all the advice in it. There's still some pages left. Alright. So it's going to take us a total of three nights to read that. But it's going to help us out in the long run. And we're going to need it. Because knowledge is a pain in the ass stat to get up. Today you had the day off. Waiting for Yukiko to recover. What should you do? It is a Sunday. There's not much for us to do. But there is something we should do. Yeah, hello? It's Ko. Hey Ko. You get bored. Let's hang out. Call up Daisuke too. How's that sound? Go fuck yourself. I got important things to do. Alright. Morning, Nanako. Bye, Nanako. Alright, so when you leave your house... When you leave your house in the morning... It'll be daytime out here, but... If you try to go back in, it'll automatically transition, transition to night. So make sure you want to do stuff outside of your house when you leave for that day. What I'm going to do is I'm going to head to the Central Shopping District... And I am going to go into the velvet. Actually, before I do that, hold up. Head over here. I think I have something to sell to you. Do I? Nope. All right. Never mind. <laughs> We're going to head into the velvet room and start to take care, take care of some business. Huh? Huh? You came. I'm surprised. I didn't think you were that interested. You can take that out of context as much as you want. Look, I'm sure you already know, but I want you to take me somewhere. It's small, it's dark, the nose never says anything, it's stuffy in here. I'm really not supposed to leave the room, but Margaret said it would be okay if I went with you. Uh, well, never mind. So will you take me somewhere? It seems Maria's intent on going out. If you come closer to her, maybe she can tell you something. Really? Don't you think you're giving into this easily? I'll have you twisted around my finger if you keep this up. Oh, Marie, with your hot topic stockings and boots and collar and hat. I'm already wrapped around your finger. <laughs> twisted around my finger. That's the saying, right? I've been studying. Let's go. Well, let's go. You decided to take Marie outside the velvet room. Now, I have a question because I'm not really sure. Do you need an arcana? Do, do you need Marie's Arcana Persona? That's a weird way of phrasing that. Do you need an Arcana Persona? Arcana. Do you need a fucking Aeon Persona to help level up Marie's shit? Or is she like... Does she work like the Hermit? <laughs> the Fox, where like it kind of just goes up depending on when you do it. Shopping District. You took Marie out of the Velvet Room. I can finally breathe now. It's stuffy in that car. So, uh... Kind of a sensitive topic, Marie. Do you guys ever take a shower? <laughs> Have a match in Arcana, which you socially gives you more points. I know it does, but I know, um... I know that when it comes to the Fox, it doesn't matter. And when it comes to the Death Arcana, it kind of doesn't matter either, because just hanging out with her levels her up, really. So I'm not sure with Marie if she's in the same boat as that. Same thing with the Jester, I think. I don't think you really need anything for the Jester. There are some, there are some characters that you don't... Very few. But there are some that you don't need for. I'm not sure if Marie's one of those. I know. I feel weird. It's like nostalgic for the smell and all. 
Hmm. It's because the countryside, baby. Really? Yeah, is that why? The countryside causes me to feel nostalgic. Hmm. There's a lot of stuff that I've never noticed before. A steak skewer. Hey. Hey, lady. I'm on one of those skewer things. Oh, hello. That would be 320 yen, please. It's difficult to say. 320... <laughs> tree fitty? <laughs> She's like, tree fitty yen? It's hard to say. Can't eat without money. Want me to pay for it? Huh? You got money? <laughs> She's so surprised. You got money? That's awesome. You're awesome. Marie looks surprised. What's up? Hey, yo, getting your steak on, huh? She's cute. What? What? What is? What's going on here? Who's that? Listen, you are you getting some without me? <laughs> Can't be having none of that. She's my sister, dog. Huh? Si well, she does have your eyes. What is this? Not your sister. Why are you lying? Nah, totally fell for it. Man, don't BS me when you know I'm gonna find out. Well, she could have played along. Damn it. Oh yeah, I'm Yosuke Hanamura. I'm his friend, his partner, you know. Part you know, Yosuke, you really shouldn't be going around telling people you're my partner. They might take it out of context. Partner? You mean like a close friend? <laughs> That's about sums it up. What's your name? Uh, Marie? Hmm, Marie-chan, is it? You want a steak skewer? Alright, it's on me. You mean you'll buy it for me? Is that okay? You should reserve yourself. You fucking skank. <laughs> Stop whoring yourself out for meat. Hey, don't worry. I got a little extra in my last paycheck. Three steak skewers. One for each of us. Oh my, business is booming. Just a moment. Wow, you never had three customers before? Lady, I bought like... I bought a steak skewer from you the other day. Was I your only customer? You ate steak skewers with Yosuke and Marie. Phew. Is that a belly full or what? This place always has huge portions. So Marie, what did you think of the local specialty? It's really weird. It's tough. It's hard to bite into. And it got cold while I was eating it. It's fucking great. Oh. Well, that's good. Didn't sound like you liked it there at the beginning. But, all well it ends well. Hey, why is it called steak anyways? Is it short for something? It is short for steak. Steak? <laughs> That's stupid. Might as well just call it ache. That's what I'm gonna do. <sighs> that isn't much better. And you, don't tell her lies. She'll believe it. Telling lies? No, Yosuke. <laughs> you eat this every day? No fair. I should have came here earlier. It seems Marie had taken a liking to steak skewers. You made small talk with Yosuke and Marie. Whoa. Ah, crap. I left my keys back in my locker at work. I gotta go back to Junez. See you later, you. You too, Marie-chan. Your partner's a funny person. That he is. Hmm. But he bought me meat. <laughs> He's weird, but he gave me some of the shmeat, so it makes me feel good. <laughs> that is a fact. Meat makes everything better. You hear that? You hear that, you fucking vegans? Vegetarians? Meat makes it all better in the end. <laughs> hey, let's go somewhere. Somewhere with a nice view. The hill overlooks town. After several times in, in which you lost Marie the moment you took your eyes off her, you managed to bring her here. Oh. Hmm. It's really green here. Green and green and some brown and darker green. A little bit of red. <laughs> Leaves of green fly away. Farewell to you, clouds of sky. A fly, I fly as well. Lost as the day. Farewell to you, moon of night. Marie is murmuring something to herself. Whatever it is, it rhymes. Leaves a green fly away. Farewell to you, clouds of sky. 
Only day in a way really matches. Did it really rhyme? Do you know what a rhyme is? It's a weird rhyming scheme. Said no. What was it? It was A, B, A, C? Was that it? I wasn't making a poem. It's just some words that I was thinking about, that's all. Shut up, I hate you, stupid jerk. Don't snoop on me. Marie's blushing. Wow, it's pretty big. I don't know why, but I feel good about this place. It reminds me of something. Are there any other places we can go? I want to see more. Hmm. Are you asking me to take you? Of course I am, stupid. I notice a lot of things when I'm with you. It's pretty fun. You sense that Marie expects something of you. <laughs> you feel that she's reaching into your wallet as you speak. Thou art I, and I am thou. As such establish a new bond, it brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the Aeon Arcana. I'm gonna have to get an Aeon as fast as possible. <laughs> Alright, next. Where to now? See ya. You show Maria around, then escort her back to the Velvet Room. Hi, Nanako. I'm back. Uh, let's see. It is a Sunday. I gotta remind myself to head to the river during the daytime because I gotta get something from the old man. I'm going to check. Check what personas we can fuse at the moment just to see if we can get ourselves an Aeon to make it a little bit easier in the future. I highly doubt it, though. Oh no, we can get one. Oh, that's a lot though. Double chariot. All right, shit. <laughs> Fuck. Check pendium. Register. All right. Oh, comes with invigorate one. Oh wait, level eighteen. Duh. Stupid. All right. Well, we can't get that at the moment. Don't have to worry about lovers or emperors for a bit. Strength, I do kind of need one. I need strength, moon, sun. Hangman can wait. Strength, moon. Slime. Hold up. Hermit, we don't ever need. Hermit's fine. Jester's fine too. I think, at least. Yeah, Jester's fine. Yeah, you don't need nothing for Jester, really, to be honest. Same thing with Empress, you don't need it. Um, Fortune's gonna be hanging there for a good while. So, what do I need for, for Moon? Let me just check that again. Oh, that's level 20, fuck. I'm using U2. I'm gonna need to get that back. Um, Dia's good, and Gar. Just skip that. I'm Valkyrie. You shall witness my power with you, with your own two eyes. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Cool. Thanks a lot, Valkyrie. Allow Dia to change? Uh, whoa. Sure. Rakukaja. Since you're gonna learn media, anyways. Alright. So there's that. Sun at level 10, which I have. Sun's gonna be important. Growth 1. Fuck yeah. That'll be cool to have. Um, Rakunda is always nice. Evil Touch, Dia. Be on the safe side. I am the great Kate Sith. In my greatness, I have come to serve. Allow it to change? Yep, I'm not gonna use it. Zeo, I'll take it. Oh, 
Okay. Uh, Tower Temperance, we're fine. Gonna head to the Compendium, though. Just to pick back a couple of you guys. Uh, what don't I have on me, actually? I have to check. <laughs> I have to check what personas I actually have on me. Uh, I can only pick up three more, so... Magician, Chariot, and, uh... This is Devil. And Temperance. That's what I'm gonna do. Uh... Well, I guess Valkyrie's gonna be acting as my strongest one right now, so... You for Magician. Chariot. Uh, Temperance. And actually, I want to head over to Fuse Personas just to... My bad, not that one. Fuse, Normal. Double Strength. I want to switch Devil out for Justice. Yes, for Justice. Personas, Devil, I'm actually not really going to need you right now, to be honest. For a while, anyways. Because my night time is going to be spent with Nanako. So, uh, just pick up Angel. Do I even have enough money for Angel? Yes, I do. Alright, there we go. All the Personas we need right now. And we won't be able to get Aeon until, like, level 18, so, you know, there's that. Uh, go back home. Here, back in the home, we're gonna crack open a nice book. Gonna crack this bad boy open. Like so. Skip that. No, nothing changes when you read the books. It's the same dialogue. You overheard two students. The cultural clubs are accepting new applicants starting today. We're welcome. You're welcome to join, even if you're already in sports club. Which is, uh, which cultural club should I join? You're gonna join a sports and cultural club? Aren't you going? Aren't you gonna end up half-assing both of them? Ouch. You don't have to be so harsh. I mean, I put some thought into it. Studying and grades are important, but I thought I should just join a club and improve my personal skill. Oh. Then do you want to join our club? If you were serious about it, we welcome you. you gotta get ready. My bag! And that's the only time you'll ever see that little monstrosity running around. <laughs> Alright. Good morning. Today I have to. Uh, today you'll have to run so much you'll have sore muscles. Don't look so sad. Everything requires muscles after all. Why I'm gonna make you run until you're sore because that's how your muscles grow efficiently. Hey Narakami, answer this one. What is it called when you gain more muscle after getting sore? It is called overcompensation, I think. You must be working out, Narakami. That's right. It's called overcompensation. Because you're always overcompensating for something else, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> if, the rest, if you rest for a couple of days after getting muscle soreness, you'll have more muscle than you started with. If you use this to your advantage, you can gain muscle efficiently. Now, enough jibber-jabber. I'll have you run until you're sore. Forget about your other classes, just run. Work hard, you can do it. You answer correctly. Your knowledge has increased. Ooh, aren't you smart. Because you know how to overcompensate. Alright. Today, we can join a sports club. A uh, sports club. We can join a cultural club. Um. But I think. I think I should pass on that, actually. Because it is Monday. And if anything, I want to make my Mondays. My Mondays and my Saturdays. <laughs> Next girl. 
<laughs> I'll tell the next girl I see that I'm overcompensating. Great. That means I'm lifting. Why are you running the other way? All right. Um. I want to focus on the daycare stuff as much as possible, because to me, that has always been one of the most annoying ones to increase. Oh shit, before, I almost forgot. I almost forgot, something you want to do. Head on down to Simigawa Floodplain. Head on down to the riverbank. And talk to the old man. Hmm, I got a problem. I thought I might do some fishing, and I brought my rod, but there's no hook. I feel bad asking since I don't know you, but can you spare me a fish? God. Can you spare me a fish? My voice, uh, kill me. All right, whatever. Give him the fish book. Great. Going fishing? All right. You give him the fish hook, and he's all like, here's a fishing rod, dude. And then uh, you do that. Set that in motion. Um. Da, 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 da. All right. I'm trying to think if there's anything else we need to set in motion before uh, moving onward. Actually, always check back. I don't know what day it is that it shows up, but there's going to be a book that helps you read faster, and we're going to need that. <laughs> we're going to need that. Uh, take the bus hill over looking town? Yes. You head out? Uh, you head out at the- fuck. You helped out at the daycare center. I don't want to play house. Let's play hide and seek. You're it. You just full of energy. Once again, the children tug at you from all directions. Your understanding has increased. You coon. Most of the children have been picked up, so you can go home now. I'll see you next time. You finished your job and went home. I had a moment. I'm not gonna lie, I had a moment because I was like, wait a minute, what? Where? What happened? Where's my social link? <laughs> on the way home, on the Simigawa floodplain, you see Yuta's mother sitting over there. Oh, hello. Oh, you're the caretaker I met the other day, right? Oh, it's already this late. I've been sitting here all this time. Something on your mind? Oh no, it's nothing. <laughs> you're a high school student, right? You seem so mature. Yes, officer? That lady right there. I was heading over there. I was gonna pick up Yuta. But then something came over me. My legs just went weak all of a sudden. Every time I think about him. Yes, officer? That lady over there. <laughs> Have you heard? Yuta and I aren't related. Yes, officer? <laughs> He's my husband's child. I live with Yuta for six months now. Only six months. Already six months. You don't ever talk. We don't ever talk to each other. My husband is away, so <laughs> it's just the two of us alone together in a dark house. Officer? <laughs> Alright. That sounds tough. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to tell you this all out of the blue. Please don't overreport me to the authorities. <laughs> I'm glad you listened to me, that you spoke with me. It's sad, but these days I don't even get to I don't even get to have a simple conversation like this. Yuta's mother Yuta's mother is smiling weakly. It seems she's trying her best to adopt to living in the countryside. You feel a faint bond forming between you and Yuta's mother. A <laughs> mother with an unfulfilled <laughs> marital relationship. Thou art I, and thou art thou. Thou hast established a new bond, it brings thee closer to the truth, and to the jail cells. <laughs> thou shalt be blessed with creating personas of the Temperance Arcana. You have established a young mother social link of the Temperance Arcana. You may earn EXP for Temperance Persona. I'm Ari Manami. Hi, Ari. 
Nice to meet you. Please take good care of him. Well, that's right. I still need to pick him up. It was nice seeing you. <laughs> that's right. I left my I left my stepchild alone for like hours. Welcome home. Hi, Nanako. I went shopping today. The fridge is full of food. Damn it! It's such a tempting offer. Whenever she says that, that means you can open up the fridge and cook some stuff. This will help you. This, if you do it right, it will help you with your uh, social links. If you do it wrong, you wasted your fucking time. Um, shit. I'm trying to think. Should I read? Should I? Well, damn it. You know what? We're not focusing on social links too much this playthrough because we really can't. You really can't, <laughs> to be honest. Um, here's what I'm gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. I won't make the food, and I'm not gonna read tonight, because tonight we're gonna head to the riverbank. Now, actually, before I do that, one thing I actually wanna do <laughs> before we head to the riverbank, uh, I wanna head to the shopping district. Because I want to save my game. Now this might... Listen. For the most part, I'm not going to be doing this for most of the playthrough. This is probably the only time I might save Scum. Only time. Alright. So the reason we wanted those breadcrumbs... Because we need to get ourselves at least two... I think I need, I think we need two at least. Um two goldfishes. Red goldfish I think they're called. All right. Uh-huh. Fishing is pretty self-explanatory. You hold the button, stay in the blue, don't go in the red. Red goldfish. Your diligence is still at its limits. You should stop fishing and go home. Fuck. I'm so used to be able to fish as much as I can. You know? As much as I want, anyways. You overheard students talking. Oh yeah, did you hear? They found Yukiko-senpai. Oh really? Huh. Does that mean she wasn't part of the case? How should I know? I just hear people talking about it. Huh. But Yukiko-senpai might have been the next target after Saki-senpai, right? The culprit definitely goes after people based on looks. What? But those two are totally different. Plus, I heard that Saki-senpai got around. By the way, guess what? It's gonna start raining tonight. Really? Seriously? I didn't know that. <laughs> Let's start talking about the weather. Oh my god, lady, you're hideous. What happened to you? I heard there are mysterious animals dwelling in the shopping district area. Supposedly, it knows how to search the change dispensers of the vending machines. How amazing is that? Even animals can learn the value of money. I guess I'll have to keep my wallet more secure from now on. Soon as at your age might not understand, but money is very important. You can't do anything without it. Oh boy, isn't that true. And you know, smarts don't guarantee wealth. Anyways, I guess I should do what they pay me for and lecture you. Let's see, we left off talking about properties of whole numbers. Well, Miss Atanaka, tell me which of these don't exist. Uh, which one was it? Do you know you? I don't think I heard of these. Emmy capable num numbers? Patrol sociable. Eh? Oh, that one. I can hear you, Miss Atanaka, and it's wrong. You haven't changed. Marriage no- Fuck! Damn it, I should've- Damn it. I thought about it because I was like, it's marriage numbers, isn't it? But then I was like, wait, she has this weird... This teacher has this weird thing where she's obsessed with relationships and shit. Amicable numbers, patrol numbers, and social numbers. Sociable, my bad. Sociable numbers, <laughs> social security numbers, all exist as a type of number. However, marriage numbers don't exist. Though amicable, betrothed, and sociable exist. Deep, huh? Anyways, let's move on. This is the... What? The mer mercy pro I don't fucking know. Damn! What does she mean when she said I haven't changed? 
You embarrassed GA. I didn't embarrass GA. She embarrassed herself. My, my fault. She ain't fucking paying attention in class. You embarrassed GA. How the fuck did I embarrass GA? Stop asking me for the answers, damn it. Oh, now you want to hang out with me, huh? <laughs> after I embarrassed you. <laughs> Got time after school, want to hang out? She hangs out on the roof, where no one will come and see us. Alright, so today is what, Tuesday? Tuesday. Uh, let's see. We can hang out with Chie, or we can strengthen this one. This is a pretty easy uh -huh. path to go down. I should... Mm. What is the earliest date for uh, the romance shit? Answering without a guide? <laughs> You're a real one. <laughs> because, listen, I played out of the Persona games. Even though Persona 4 is not my favorite. That right goes to Persona 3. Um, out of all the games, I've played Persona 4 the most. So, when it comes to the questions, I remember some and I forget others. Which is why I stuttered on that question, because I was like, is it marriage numbers? No, I don't think it's marriage numbers. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think, when is the earliest time for the romance shit? It's... Is it the festival? It's the summer festival, right? Yeah, we got time. Do we got... Fuck. Is it after Rize shows up? Earliest date usually is... No, 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 not, not the level for uh, social link. I mean, like, the event. Like, they had, you know, how they have Christmas and Valentine's and shit like that. Uh, I think it's after Rize shows up, right? Then we head out to the, um, Summer Festival. Right? No, 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 wait, mm. Culture Festival? What is it? Fuck! It's the it's not the camping trip. Ah, fuck it. Whatever. We're not gonna worry about Chia right now. Uh, hit the basketball practice. It's one where they wear the kimono. So yeah, it's like after Rize shows up. Cool. <laughs> so we got a bunch of time to worry about that. All right. You feel the relationship is gonna become closer soon. Good. Because I do want to show those off. Because I need to get people to start fighting each other in chat. <laughs> Welcome home. Uh, it's raining tonight. Since it's raining, you don't want to go fishing because our chances of getting a red goldfish is going to be down. Um, we can read a book. <laughs> we can read a book. You don't need to romance anyone for that? Hmm. Really? You sure? Hey, no, because the next day they call you, right? Yeah, no, the next day after that, uh, Rize's always gonna call you, but if you don't have Yukiko or Chie high enough, they won't call you. Why did I... Ah, fuck. I pressed the wrong... I pressed the wrong button. I went to the fucking bench like an idiot. I was supposed to read the book. We're on the last chapter. <laughs> it's raining. Doesn't seem like we can do much today. Um... Uh... Which means... Oh, wait, no. We have a uh, school. Alright. I'm gonna head to the practice building. That's what we're gonna do. You head to the practice building. Can I join you on an off day? Fortunately, the door's locked. Shit, I have to join you... The fuck you said? Mondays? Alright, I'm gonna have to take a Monday. Uh, wait, when is the... When do you motherfuckers meet? Tuesday, Thursday, Saturdays. And she is... Thursday. Okay, I'll take a Thursday. I'll take a Thursday. Ryusuke will ask you uh, <laughs> who you think's the hottest and the person you choose. You'll go with the next day. Oh, no, no, no. That one just boosts, uh, you know, their, their social link points or whatever the fuck. That doesn't really do that. If you have no one, they'll pity you at Rize the next day. But if you 
do have someone, they'll call you the next day. And you can pass them off or not. I distinctly remember that. Because I know there's like an earliest point for stuff like that. It's for New Game Plus shit. That's why they put it in it. Put it in there like that. Um, It's raining. It's a Wednesday. And here's the thing that I really fucking hate. <laughs> right? In Persona 4, you can head to the library and study. Right? Which is good. But at the same time, you can't head to the library and read a book. That sucks. <laughs> that sucks. But it's a rainy day, which means time to time to do what we need to do, right? Also, after hanging out with Marie, you want to periodically head to the Velvet Room because she might have a poem for us. Nope. All right, cool. She might have a poem for us, maybe. Sometimes. All right. So we're going to head over here, sit on down to Aya. This is Chinese Diner Aya. Aya seems to have some special promotion today. Rainy Day Challenge, 3,000 yen mega beef bowl. If you finish this quintuple size bowl, it's free. You got 11,000, baby. Time to munch it up, put that meat in your mouth. Central Shopping District, Chinese Dino Ayer. You accept the Rainy Day Special Mega Beef Bowl Challenge. You still can't see the rice. You begin to suspect that your bowl is a, is a portal into the meat dimension. The amount of meat contained within the bowl is truly staggering. In order to finish this bowl, you must have understanding of your limits, knowledge to control your pace, courage to face this unrelenting tide of beef, and the diligence to per persevere against this colossal challenge. All these traits are necessary to master the rainy day special, special, special mega beef bowl challenge. You are unable to finish your meal in your current state. You tried your best to finish the rainy day special mega, special mega beef bowl challenge. And your personality has grown tremendously. Understanding has increased. You went from basic to kindly. Knowledge has increased. Courage has increased. Aya! Too bad, mister. That'll be 3,000. Come back soon, bitch. Aya, oh, yeah, you must be a student at high school. My daughter goes there too, but we didn't put her in this game for some reason. She's my pride and joy, not to mention a big draw for the customers, but she's not in this game for some reason. Listen, guys, if you make a Persona 4 Golden remake, you can throw Aya in there. That's just, that's the only thing the game's missing. <laughs> Another waifu to fight over. After finishing your meal, you went home. Poochie round two. Hi, Nanako. I'm back. Alright, we're gonna go upstairs, and we're... gonna read that damn book. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, fucking, um... Best girl of Persona 4 isn't in Persona 4. <laughs> oh, man. She is pretty cool, though. I'm surprised that... Because, did this game... This game came out... Was when was I was she introduced in the Persona anime or the Persona Golden anime? She was introduced in the anime, the regular anime, right? The, I don't remember. The regular anime, right? So when they get golden, why the fuck did they put her in the game? <laughs> Especially since after that they're like, yeah, we're gonna do a golden anime. Which is, honestly, in my opinion, besides, like, the Marie shit they added in their fucking... It's worse than the original. And we all know Persona 5 anime is bad. Don't at me. It's fucking terrible. It's not cool. It's garbage. Why didn't they just keep the people who did the Daybreaker special? That that was great. That was a great one. I liked it. It actually looked good. <laughs> the rain doesn't seem to be letting up this morning. No. And then for some reason they got the team that did the fucking Persona 5 anime and made them do the opening for Royal, which is garbage. <laughs> hey, Yuhiko told me that she'll be able to come to school again in two days. Oh man, I'm glad. I'm so happy. Aw, thanks to you, Chie. Seriously, it's actually thanks to you. We were gonna get our asses kicked. Come on, you know it's because all three of us did our best. Besides Yosuke, he died like five times. 
Actually, more like the three of us and one animal thingy. Classes have ended for today. You're waiting for Yukiko. Alright. It is a Thursday. Like I said, I'm going to take that Thursday out and head on down to the practice building. Because we need to get the drama started. Now, before we, uh... <laughs> Before we enter the drama club, let's just show you what you're missing out if you don't choose the drama club. This is the music room used for the symphonic band. Do you want to join the symphonic band? Eh, get a tour first. Yasugami High Music Room. You watch the symphonic band rehearse. That creature. That's what you're missing out if you don't choose band club. And guess what? No one chooses fucking band club. Garbage. <laughs> Actual garbage. Literal trash. Literal, like no, I don't know anyone who defends that cretin. Right? It looks like this is meeting room used for a drama club. Now to be honest, Yes, Drama Club is a better choice, but at the same time, the person for Drama Club is just as terrible as the other one. The only difference is that she doesn't completely look like a monstrosity. <laughs> Let's move on to Tongue Twisters. Ready? The six chick- oh, fuck. <laughs> Let's do Tongue Twisters. Fucked up on the second word. The six chicks cheeks six cheap. The six, six, sheep, six, sheep, sick. You're still not saying it correctly. Are you sure you're, in, you're the club president? Oh, a new guy. You're Narakami from second year, right? The transfer student. I see, I see. Welcome to Drama Club. I'm the club president. Um, na Nagi, na Nagi, Nagi. It's Nagi, right? Just, just Nagi. I'm Yumi Azawa. I'm Yumi Azawa, you pretentious bitch. <laughs> I'm in second. All right, listen. I made fun. I know in the first session of the streams, I made fun of of uh, Saki Senpai having a fucking nine by five head, right? Here's the thing. I know I made fun of Saki Senpai, but let's be honest with ourselves. Saki Senpai, you know, she gave herself a middle part. She didn't really need it. Her hair's kind of thin and wavy, right? She could have just done a side part. She'd be fine. Yumi, on the other fucking hand, she has a side part, and that doesn't even help her. Her forehead is fucking ginormous. Yumi, you trying to get your hooks into the new guy already? Huh? No, not in the slightest. Anyways, let's continue practicing. We don't have a stage, and we haven't decided on a script yet, so we're just training. I'm sure you'll catch on. Our club meets on Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. We're not going to throw you out if you don't show up, but the more you train, the better you get. I think being in drama club helps you learn how to express yourself more adequately. Oh yeah, <laughs> I'm the club's vice president. I'm not really much help, though. That's okay, Mitan. I know you put a lot of effort into it when you throw it back. <laughs> Besides, you're cute. Don't call me Mita in front of everyone. It seems to be a friendly club. Like I said, the drama and bank kids are the horniest in school. You can forget about them. Let's practice, okay? We'll start with voice lessons. But both their foreheads come by. Listen. 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 I need you to listen. <laughs> I'm neutral in the matter. I have to be. But that's Haru, the big blood you're talking about right there, okay? And Haru has an excuse. Her hair's very curly, and as someone who has curly hair himself, you gotta, you gotta part that to the side or something. You gotta do something with it. Because leaving it by itself, it gets all up in there. And it's terrible. <laughs> that's right. Focus on your stomach. Push the air out. Now say, ah. Uh, Don't yell. You're gonna strain your throat. Yumi's co coaching is resentless. 
But yes, Haru does have a big head, and that's what I love about her, because her head is beautiful. Every time I see her, I'm like, hey, what's up, big head? <laughs> School already over? What the? Everybody's already gone. I didn't even notice. But don't worry. They'll be, they'll be white. Listen, I know Persona 5 didn't have any waifu wars, but I'll make a goddamn waifu war if I have to. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Come to practice, okay? Yes, ma'am. Okay. I'm glad you seem to take orders. Yumi smiles cheerfully. Well, fate must brought us here. Let's do the best with what we have. You joined the drama club and became acquaintances with Yumi Ozawa. Yumi is enthusiastically devoting her time to acting. You feel a faint bond formed between you and Yumi. Really? You thought Persona 5... Really? Oh. Oh, someone make a time machine and go back to 2008 all the way to 2010. Because let me tell you what happened with... Alright. Persona 5... People who are newer to Persona had the wars. Right? But people who've been through Persona 3, 4, even 2 and 1... Right? And Ultimax and all that stuff. In Persona Q, we all sat down and we went, You know what? Everyone's pretty fucking good. Besides Oya, she's fucking garbage. But everyone's pretty good. Right? There's no bad waifu in that game. Besides Oya. <laughs> right? You all sat down and you're like, Yeah, the teacher's cool. Hafumi's cool. Fucking the gang is cool. Right? Inkling's cool. <laughs> but, like, if you go back to 2008, all the way to 2010, it was just... The main thing was that, like, because, honestly, besides I and maybe Margaret... The other waifus in Persona 4 are fucking kind of trash. <laughs> so you only had Chie, Yukiko, Rize, and Naoto to really pick from. So it was very scarce. And then people fought over it for fucking years. And then Ultimax came, not Ultimax, my bad. Arena came out and then they were like, all right, but Mitsuru's been aged up. Here's Igus again. And here's Labrus. <laughs> right? So they, they spread it thin. And then Ultimax came out and they're like, hey, by the way, uh, Yukari, remember her? She's older now. Oh yeah, have you ever gone to see a play or musical being performed live? I have a DVD you can borrow, it's called Shrek the Musical. <laughs> the other members in the drama club don't watch this kind of stuff, or even talk about it. But yeah, fucking, oh, oh Persona 4 hurts the most. Yumi passionately discusses acting as you walk home together. It hurts me on, on, on such a deep level. Welcome home, Nanako. Why did I tell her welcome home? Why did I do that? Alright, it's a rainy day. Saying though you don't have strong feelings about the Persona 5 girls. <laughs> Not even the teacher? I know a lot of people love the teacher. We'll talk about the teacher when we get to Persona 5. That's what we'll do. I finished this book, by the way, right? <laughs> Yeah, you don't have nothing to read. Okay, cool. Yep. Time to get that studying going. I want the teacher to be my wife. <laughs> Listen. It's hard to pick a favorite. I'm informed now. It's hard to pick a favorite from Persona 5 because there's a lot. You know who's like really passed up upon? Why am I talking about Persona 5? We're playing Persona 4. God damn it. But who's really passed up upon and people don't really talk about that much? Fucking uh, Chihaya. She's great. The fortune teller? She's pretty cool. Today's show a day, so you have the day off from school. Wait for Yukiko. Her and her little country accent. It's great. I love it. Like I said, I don't know anyone who goes like, Yeah, Oya's the best. <laughs> they go, Oya, oh, yeah, and I go, Oh yeah? <laughs> Alright, let's see. It's Friday. It's raining. Can't do the daycare stuff. Not really much we can do besides the rainy day beef bowl challenge, which will help a lot. How much money do I have? 
Ugh, that's gonna make me broke. Um. Well, we're not really gonna be spending money that much. Yeah, we need it. I'll do knowledge when I can, but more importantly, I have to do uh, understanding and expression because that's gonna help us a lot down the road. Um. <laughs> All right, just checking in. Nothing yet? Nope, all right. Guess we gotta hang out with her another time. Whenever we have free time. Now, it's bare saying there are some social links that do have a very, very hard-ass time limit to do them in. Uh, Marie is one of them. The Jester is one of them. Uh, and so is Nanako and Dojima when they become available. So you kinda wanna keep an eye out for that stuff. Which is why we need to get our understanding and expression up as much as possible. You put that meat in your mouth. You still can't finish it. Too much meat for you, man. You tried your best to finish the range depot challenge, but you suck. Understanding increased. Knowledge increased. Hey, my knowledge still went up. Diligence. Nice. It's bad, mister. That's 3,000. I couldn't throw it back. I couldn't throw the meat back down my throat fast enough. So they kicked me out. Due to the weekend rainfall, clear skies seem unlikely in the area. A thick fog is expected to set in tonight and remain until tomorrow morning. I'm talking Heaviest thick with about like 25 different type area. of seas. Anyone planning to go out tonight should take care. Now for our hourly weather breakdown. More fog, huh? There's been a lot of that lately. Hopefully it's not a sign of more trouble. More trouble. More money, more problems. Uh, uh, uh. What did I say about changing the channel without asking? What did I say about changing the channel without asking, Nanako? You know daddy's gonna have to beat you now. <laughs> have a great day, even during Golden Week. <laughs> it's so bad. Local Juness. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Every day's great at your Juness. Every day is great at your Juness. I'm gonna make that my fucking ringtone. Dad, they're going to be open during Golden Week. <laughs> Golden I Week? Heard. That's where all the Are anime games go on sale. <laughs> we can go somewhere? How about it? Got any plans yet? <laughs> we can leave the house, Dad? Finally. Got any plans? Nope, no plans. I'm lonely. Nanako, I love you, but I find it weird that you're really surprised to head to a fucking supermarket. You sure you want to go to Jeunesse? We can go there anytime. Yeah, exactly, right? You've never seen a kid so excited to go to fucking Walmart. Come <laughs> like, on, girl. Time for bed. Like, yeah! We're in the Wally world! All right. Every day's great at your Jeunesse. Nanako seems very excited about this family outing. You're weird, Nanako. That's why you're cool. All right. Uh, I can study tonight. Did she put food in here? Nothing catches your eyes. Nope, nothing catches my eyes. Oh, Midnight Channel. Yeah, gotta check it. Make sure Yukiko doesn't die. <laughs> Even though she's out of the TV. It's midnight. It's close to midnight. Someone's lurking something in the dark. Uh, I don't remember the lyrics. Fox has set in. All right. If my TV ever made that noise, I would just, I would just throw it out. <laughs> like even for this game takes place in what? Oh shit! This game takes place in what? Twenty eleven. Persona 3 takes place 2009, and this one takes place 2011, right? Am I bugging? Am I... Yeah, 2011. Yeah, 2011. Thank you. Fucking... I remember because of Persona Q. It's like, it's 2011, and fucking... You're hearing this on your TV? What the hell? Since so Shishiko has been rescued, it seems Killer was thwarted this time. It's like, time for you to get a different TV, motherfucker. Goddamn. 
Oh, I've been streaming for four hours. <laughs> Got a couple more minutes, and then I'm going to have to call it quits. Meanwhile, at the Fog Shrouded Shopping District. Oh no, the Silent Hill monsters. They come about. Saturday, the 30th. Time for the game to start throwing throwing romance oh. in your face. Good morning. I gotta point out, I find it funny how like Yukiko gets saved and then they're like, You like Yukiko, right? And then the moment Rize shows up, the game just shoves her out the way. Oh, morning. How you feeling? Um Yes. I'm better now. I'll be coming to school again, so that that'll be nice. <laughs> I caused everyone some real trouble. That you did. I'm sorry. No, sorry isn't quite right. What I mean to say is, thank you. Oh, you're quite welcome. Yukiko seems more cheerful than before. My mother's back to work already. The maids are being really supportive. And I think things are going even smoother than before. I wonder if I was trying too hard. I may have been too caught up in the idea that I had to do everything myself. Ever since the incident, I feel like I can think about these things more calmly. But... It's still kind of embarrassing. You can't help but smile at a face like that. <laughs> you guys saw everything, even the things I didn't want to admit. Uh... You've already changed, Yukiko, just a little bit. Really? God, when I hear the fucking loud thunder piercing my ears, hi, Chie. Oh, it's Chie. Well, I'll talk to you later. See you later, leggings. <laughs> she goes, come. Is that, the, is that her only defying trait? She has leggings? <laughs> right? It's a good thing you were able to save her. Listen, I'm a whore for some high knee socks. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> hmm, Yukiko san is back. That's good. I'm glad the only cutie in class was able to return. What the fuck? Yes, officer. Fucking Mr. Rogers right there. <laughs> He's not my friendly neighbor. Oops. I mean, all you are cute. No, not really. Uh, please don't tell your parents I said that. <laughs> Will ya? I don't want to get in trouble. I already have five different restraining orders on me. One more, they're gonna have to kick me out of class. Anyways, I have an interesting topic for you today. Close your books and take a look at this handout. Yes, it is a picture of my dick. Sounds like a good time to pick up on the city boy, huh? What's the greatest canyon in the solar system? D's nuts. <laughs> it's a canyon. Uh... Valis whatever. Wow, you really are from the city. Well, I guess that doesn't have anything to do with it. The Valleys Marinus, 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 whatever, on Mars is ten times larger than the Grand Canyon. Mars also hosts uh, Olympus Mons, the largest mountain in the solar system. Both the highest mountain and the greatest canyon are on Mars. Isn't that useful information? Fuck no. Since you, since you got me started on canyons, I'm going to cover some material on their characteristics. You gave the correct answer. Your dick has grown bigger. Everyone loves you now. Sorry to keep you waiting. The soap was yours, right, Chie? Thanks! Oh, that smells so good! Alright, lady, it's noodles. These instant noodles are just the thing to help me through club! How much longer do I have to wait on this? It still needs a few minutes. So why are we here? Oh yeah, we were gonna ask Yukiko what happened. I love how they both eat out of their respective dog bowls. <laughs> the green one goes to Chie, the red one goes to Yukiko. Yukiko-san, I hate to bring up stuff you'd rather not think about, but I need to ask you again. Did you recall anything about when you got kidnapped? No. I thought I might remember something if I let it sit for a while. But as time passes, it only gets hazier. Useless bitch. <laughs> I think the doorbell rang at the entrance, and someone called for me. 
It sounded just like this. Yukiko, Yoohoo, come here. I have a special delivery for you. But when I woke up after that, I was already in the castle. I'm sorry. I was already whoring myself off in the castle. No need to apologize. But does this mean her visitor is the culprit? I don't know. Most likely. If it's true, then that's one daring criminal. What kind of killer would ring the doorbell? Ted Bundy? <laughs> Sorry. That got kind of dark for a moment. The police are probably looking for witnesses, but I don't think we can expect much from them. <laughs> As if the culprit wore bright yellow clothes at the scene of the crime. I wonder why whoever it is would do stuff like this. We won't know until we confront them ourselves. But we can be sure of one thing. It's no coincidence that people keep ending up in that place. Someone on our side is definitely kidnapping them and throwing them into the TV. It's murder, all right. Murder by television. Yeah, we never told you. This guy and me are going to catch the culprit ourselves. The police are out of their league on this case, but we got personas. Never fear. We'll get them. Oh, okay. I'm helping out, too. I can't believe someone would throw people into a place like that. I'm gonna sock whoever's doing this. Chie. Let me help too. I want to know why this is happening. Especially if someone hates me so much they want to kill me. I don't know, just check the Reddit forums, you'll find out why. <laughs> I don't want to run away from myself anymore. Or like five hour video essays as to why Yukiko is the worst <laughs> waifu in the game. All right. And let's all work together and catch this asshole. Agreed. Speaking of dog bowls, why is Yukiko and Chie the only students wearing colors in the entire school? <laughs> Adachi shows up. He's like, nigga, I'm back. Don't worry, don't- I know everyone's going, oh, He said the N-word! I'm black. Let it pass, alright? I'm born with natural immunity, baby. I'm also light-skinned as fuck. I have all these buffs that I were born with. Natural buffs. The investigation team has grown to level two. But how are we gonna find them? We don't have a single lead yet! I'm the third one to be targeted so far, but I have a feeling this isn't the end of it. If we had an idea of who might be targeted next, wouldn't we have an advantage over the killer? Would you? So we'll outsmart them, huh? Yeah, that might work. Okay, so let's see if we can figure out what ties the victims together. First, there was that announcer, Mayumi Yamano. Second, was Saki Konishi. Senpai. Senpai! Third, <laughs> was Yukiko Amagi. You bitch made Yosuke. <laughs> Senpai! Still crying over. They all have in common. She didn't like you, man. They're all female. Bingo. How dare he target females? Now that's unforgivable. The culprit's got to be some kind of pervert. Also, what about this? The second and third victims had some sort of connection to the first one. Hey, that's right. Yukiko and Saki Senpai both had connections to that announcer. <laughs> I'm black too. If I were to stream, I would completely allow the N word because honestly, it's just worth. Exactly, right? You know? That's true. Like, dude, like, I talked about it before in one of, uh. And, uh, I think it was in, like, Sly Cooper or something. It's on the channel or whatever. But it's like, it's like, most people who get mad over that stuff never really came to face with, like, real racism. As to where, like, both me and my mother constantly come to face with that dumb shit. Like, the other day, my mom was like, I'm working for this old lady, and she just started calling me out my name. And I was like, what? And she said, that's why I let the old lady sit in her shit for all day, for the whole entire day. I was like, all right, whatever, mom. Then, does that mean females connected in some way uh -oh. to Miss Yamano's Something got disconnected. Targeted? I think that's a safe assumption for now. There's another angle we can take, too. If another person disappears. You think they'd be on that midnight channel? That happened right before Yukiko was kidnapped too. Yeah. It's hard to tell who at first, 
But what's important is, it's happened before the victims disappeared. Kinda like a ransom note. We still don't know why that happens, but we'll have to rely on it for now. The next time it rains. The next time it starts drizzling and dropping? It seems that the Midnight Channel is the only means to predict who will be kidnapped next. You beat Shadow Easy earlier in New Game Plus? Nice. Like I said, in the background, I'm running a New Game Plus uh, thing just, you know, just in case. Especially towards the ending, right? Because, you know, you get to the end of Persona and you kind of want to have that... You want to have that moment where everyone gives you like, hey man, how's it going? <laughs> you must remember to watch it on the next rainy night. By the way, aren't those done by now? Well, oh, dude, I beat this game multiple times. Like I said, it's my most played Persona game. Even though it's not my favorite. I beat Vanilla, uh, I beat Vanilla Persona 4 multiple times, I beat the one on the Vita multiple times, I'm playing the Steam version right now, I beat, I beat it already on Steam, <laughs> right? Uh, I have a profile on, not, not a profile I use anymore, but one of my old profiles, I have, uh, the Platinum Trophy for Persona 4 Golden, so, trust me, I know a lot about this game. Not everything, but I know a lot. And before you ask, no, I didn't use a fucking guide to get max social links. I actually did it myself. Hey, could I try just a little bit of that? It was pretty just easy. Tiny bite. It was close though. It was really close. Hands up the soba pal. Go get your own if you want some. Okay. Just one bite. She's Got like it. a fucking ravenous dog. <laughs> My food, don't touch it. The delicious aroma from the udon bowl is drifting your way. Do you want to try some? All right, Yukiko, listen up. I'm going to show you how to eat properly. This is how a man wants you to do it. You take it, and you just go... Just slurp it down. It's so good. The aroma, the flavor, and the texture all combined. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Uh, spoilers just for the viewers trying to avoid talking about uh, mentally convinced. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, not even the events themselves, but mostly just uh, when, like, you when the bigger things happen. Thing. Like, you know, like the chase scene and fucking, uh, you know, who the culprit is. Stuff like that. Because Persona 4 does this really awesome thing, and I like it. And I, I never got it wrong, so I don't know how it goes. But uh, there's a moment where the game just goes, All right, you're at a dead end. Now you have to choose who the fuck the culprit is. I never gotten it wrong myself, right? But it's a moment where the game just goes, Fucking figure it out, dude. <laughs> My fried tofu. And that's really good. I like that moment in this game. I hope you guys understand what this means. Wait, 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 stop! I'm sorry! I'll buy you steak! It'll be on me! You hear me? The very best! Steak? You know what they say, Che. Gotta take a break to slake with steak. My tofu. Come on, Yukiko! There's steak in it for us now! She's a fucking animal! <laughs> Come on, Yukiko! It's me! We can eat instant noodles anytime we want, right? Hope Persona 6 has that moment? Exactly, right? Like, I don't need everything to be like a murder mystery, but, you know, it, it's just a moment where the game goes, alright, now fucking figure it out. Now, me, personally, I never got it wrong, so I don't know what happens if you get it wrong. I don't know if the game continues, right? That's a good moment in this game, but there's a there's also a really bad moment in this game, and it's the moment that comes before that, where it's like, alright, Pick all these choices. If you fuck it up once, you get the bad ending. And I'm like, what the fuck is that about? Well, as long as it isn't too fatty. It's almost as it's almost as bad as Shimigami Tensei 4's uh, morality system. Which, eh, we'll get to, whenever I get to Shimigami Tensei 4, we'll talk about it. But it's like both. It's a double-edged sword. It's both good and bad. Okay, we've reached the verdict. You are hereby sentenced to buying a steak. You are hereby sentenced to put that meat in my mouth. What wouldn't be 
too fatty. Filet? Ooh, filet sounds nice and expensive. Filet, 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 filet mignon. What the fuck, Chie? Hey, you've got a pony up too. You're just as much to blame. Mm. It's my money, though. I'm already broke. Man, talk about great timing. We just started serving grilled steak today. We're doing our part to spread this town's specialty dish. Plus, we've already got an excellent grill. That's just the yakisoba griddle. Oh, well. Steak is steak. It's far from a filet steak, though. Yukiko, are you okay with this? It's not too heavy for you? Oh my god, Chi, I'm gonna get so fat. <laughs> I'll eat it. I'm still mad. Aww. I can't help but smile at Yukiko's little poutiness. It's great. So back on topic. I wonder what kind of person the culprit is. I'm still fucking mad about my food. <laughs> if you focus just on the announcer's case, it seems like a revenge thing. Maybe it was her lover's wife. But Masuzu Hiragi had a solid alibi, didn't she? And it seemed like she was already separated from her husband. Really? You know an awful lot about this. Okay. Maybe you're the, the killer. Saki-senpai. She found the announcer's body. Dude, I feel Yosuke's soul leave his body every time he says her name. He's like, Saki Senpai, huh? Assuming the same person killed them both, then why target Senpai? To shut her up. Yeah, I think so too. Maybe she found a clue or something about the culprit. But the killer just threw the announcer into a TV, right? I don't think you would have left evidence the police, much less a high school student, would catch. Yeah, exactly. Man, I thought the countryside would be a snooze. But it's proving to be a lot more exciting than I thought. Oh, they updated the menu. Huh? Isn't he that detective? You gotta go. Stream's amazing. We'll be hey, back for another. Oh, don't worry. After this, after this, I'm gonna have to end the stream because I'm over my own time. But, um... Yeah, next time I stream, uh... It won't be Persona, because we did two with Persona, and we did two with, um... With Phoenix Wright, uh, the great Ace Attorney Chronicles, the first game. Uh, so, next time we're gonna head back to that, and then after that I'll switch off between Phoenix Wright and Persona. So, next stream will either be... What? It might be... Around 12 o'clock later today? Well, I'm on the East Coast, so, uh, you know, around 12 o'clock. If not, if I don't have time for that... Then it will definitely be, um, it will be, uh, I'll put it, I'll put it on the fucking schedule, you know, it's, I gotta change schedule anyway. I'll put it on the Twitch schedule, but thanks for stopping by. <laughs> I appreciate it. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, wait. Hey, this is great timing after all. Dojima-san said that he'll be leaving work on schedule tonight. Could you pass that on to Nanako-chan? No problem. Yo, I'm Adachi, Dojima-san's gopher. Uh, I mean, his partner. Are you this busy every day? Huh? Oh, well, the public seems to be getting a charge out of these cases, but we can't leave it at that. Sorry to butt in, but could it be that the killer targeted Saki-senpai in order to silence her? Um, you sure get to the heart of the matter. Y of course, Oops. we're also <laughs> thinking along those lines. She was killed right after the announcer's body was found. Hey, you guys talking about murder? I want to talk about murder, too. If the killer was trying to silence her, there might have been something at the scene only she would have understood. Which would mean that the culprit may be someone close to Miss Konishi. Nothing like that points to Misuzu Hiragi, so... Oh, I might have stumbled across something here. Wait, are you listening to all that? Crap, me and my big mouth. Uh, don't tell anyone I said any of that, or Dojima-san will flay me alive. <clears throat> Relax, kids. The police are on the job. Uh, see ya. See ya, Dachi. You were right, Yosuke. The police are totally useless. Ah! My steak's getting cold! That's your fault, not mine. Could you shut up about the steak for five seconds? Listen, Chia, if you were gonna put that meat in your mouth, you would have done it earlier, okay? <laughs> you waited for the two to finish eating, then decided to go into the TV world. To the backside of TV, uh. I dare you look at that transition without blinking. Your retinas will burn. Wow. The 
this really is inside the TV. It's Teddy. Then it wasn't a dream. Are you feeling better, Yuki-chan? I did what you said. I've been a good bear. Oh, I see. Good boy. Stop giving into his demands, Yukiko. You're making it worse. This bear's part of the reason we want to find the culprit. I'm one of the group now, too. Let's work together, okay? Yep. I was thinking the same thing. That's why I got these ready for you, Yuki-chan. Oh, so these are what everyone's wearing. Thank you, Teddy. You're right. It's just as if the fog doesn't exist. Hey, tell me something. How come you have so many pairs of glasses? Excellent question. Guess what? I'm the one who makes them. Fucking how? I've lived here for a long time, so I came up with some ways to be comfortable here. I see. But don't you need a pair? Ooh, good point. Another great question. Listen to this. My eyes themselves are lenses. <laughs> My eyes, which I peer your souls with. <laughs> They're lenses. They see the truth. You didn't know? Of course not. <laughs> Why are you being so mean? You act like you're not interested. I'm a really dexterous bear. See how smoothly my fingers move? Fucking freak. <laughs> uh, Teddy delicately moves his fingertips. He's like, check these babies out. They call me the golden finger. What am I even looking at? Ow! Hmm? You dropped something. Oh, that's a pair I kind of screwed up on. Ooh. <laughs> hey, buddy. Get ready to laugh. Isn't these, aren't these glasses great? Y Yukiko? These fucking glasses. <laughs> How do I look? Funny shit I've ever seen. Man, it looks natural on you, you fucking clown. <laughs> awesome. Do you like that one, Yuki-chan? What's my favorite persona? It's even got a nose guard. You mean the games or the the persona themselves? Oh, no you don't. How very unfortunate. That pair doesn't have the right lenses in. Oh, the games themselves? Uh, I said it earlier. It's a uh, Persona Three. Guess I should have made an. Technically, Persona Three FPS. Ah, too bad. I like it too much. I'm sorry. There's a part of me. I don't know why I like it so much, but I do. Chie, your turn. If not, then uh, Persona Two Eternal Punishment would probably be my second favorite. Oh, the personas Bye. themselves. Okay, um... I don't know. There's... Damn, there's a lot. There's Alice. She's cool. But I mean, like, every fucking Japanese game has a fetish for Alice in Wonderland, so whatever. Alice is cool. So is, uh... I forgot what the fucking dog is called. The one that has, like, all the... All the, like... What, what is it called? The fucking mystical balls around its necks or whatever the fuck? Magnetamas or some shit? I don't know. <laughs> There's always Mara. <laughs> we all like Mara the best. <laughs> I know, I have to sit down and look at them. I do have a save file with a complete com compendium, so I would have to sit down and look at them. How'd it come to this? Of course, Yoshisune is broken as fuck. <laughs> Yukiko-san? Hello? There goes one of Yukiko's laughing fits. I never thought she'd do it when someone besides me was around. There goes one of Yukiko's random character traits that we threw in the game to make her seem more interesting. These stupid glasses are useless for investigating. <laughs> My bad, his name's not Yoshisune, it's Haso Toby, right? The Toby Hustle. What the hell's this nose for anyway? Nice work, huh? That's what happens when you guys leave me here alone and I get bored. There's also a Chu Lin, right? Chu Lin's pretty cool. Well, I'm glad that she's in high spirits again, I guess. There's a lot of cool ones. Look on your face. <laughs> you know, and you got to appreciate the classics too, Pixie and uh Pixie and uh Hiwato. I can't. Stop. <laughs> oh, oh, my stomach. 
the funniest shit I've ever seen, Yukiko. You decided to go back for it today. Jesus, fuck. Pixie's always with Demi Fien, exactly. Fourth and the fifth. Because they're friends, man. They're super friends. It makes me sad every time I... Every time I play Nocturne and, you know, Pixie turns into High Pixie and I'm like, oh, well, there she goes. It's not Pixie no more. I might be able to get the fourth and the fifth off. Really? Nocturne is weird. <laughs> I gotta say, Nocturne is fucking weird. It's, it's really hard to. Jesus. Really? What, you don't believe me? No, she doesn't believe you, Dojima. Why would she believe you? Canceled. That's a smart kid. Um, not every year. I know you wanted to go to Jeunesse, but I wouldn't mind going a little further out of the neighborhood. Really? <laughs> Can we go on a trip? In our favorite well, rocket ship? okay to go on a trip once in a while. I'm sure it'll be crowded everywhere, though. Yay! <laughs> We're going on a trip! Hmm. All right, all right. Here you ho, eat yeah, tam worm, become a demon. <laughs> Dante is also here, even though it makes zero sense. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Shimigami Tensei 3 Nocturne, featuring Dante from the Double May Cry series. How about you? You want to come along? And Knuckles. Uh, let's see. Shall I go? Why not? Yeah, let's all go together. <laughs> Looks like Nanako wants us all to go. You'll be going on outing with Dojimas during the long holiday. Let's bring box lunches. Hmm? Yeah, good idea. We're always eating side dishes for dinner. Let's make the little hot dogs that look like octopuses. But uh, I can't cook, and Nanako's not good enough yet to make them by herself. I'm a great cook. Hmm. Well, it'll work out. That's what we got this guy for, huh, Nanako? That's why we tuck in this guy. He's gonna feed us for now on. Yay! Box lunch! Cause you know we can't feed ourselves. Nanako's pleased. You've been selected to pack the family box lunches. Alright. Whew! Have made good progress today. Uh, not as good as I would like. I wish I didn't have to spend two days on that dungeon, but, you know, I did. Still got Yukiko, though. So, <clears throat> gonna end the stream off here. I just cracked my back. It felt so damn good. Gonna end the stream off here. Been streaming for what? Four and a... Oh, God. Four and a half hours. Jesus, fuck. <laughs> Time flies by when you're fucking about in Persona. Um, so, next stream that I'm gonna do, I'm gonna throw it in the... If it's not later today, right, in the afternoon... Well, for me, later today, you know, fucking... Uh, the, the East Coast and stuff like that. Um... You know, if it's not later today, then it will definitely be, uh, I'll put in the schedule, right? And we're going to be heading back into the world of the Great Ace Attorney, where we last left off with that game. Uh, we were introduced, uh, we had a little introduction to, Sh what's his name? Herlock Schlomes, right? And currently, Ryanosuke is being, is being called the culprit for killing his best friend, Cosma. So, there's all that shit going on. <sighs> Need to do that. And that's pretty much it for the streams, right? Um, on the YouTube channel, I'm going to start uploading the... Well, hell, I, one of them is already uploaded. I just got to, you know, put the finalized thing on it, let it go through. Uh, the Corpse Party, por Corpse Party Blood Drive streams that we did. Fair warning, though, the first two streams that are going to get uploaded... Um, I fucked up and I didn't record the game audio, so instead I just put some music on uh, for, you know, for for some background noise on that, right? So those two those two parts are sadly not going to have the game audio. It's kind of weird. I fucked up, okay? I fucked up, right? Uh, other than that, there's the Nightmare Before Christmas playthrough that we're doing. Yes, there's a Nightmare Before Christmas game. I put, I uh, uploaded that during... Uh, Christmas or whatever, so I'm gonna be continuing that and then uh, Upload the vampire the masquerade streams and that's pretty much it other than that other than that 
Look forward to the Pokemon Marathon get it getting started within this month. It should be this month. If not, then start of next month. I still have to finalize some things. I'm going over some stuff with other people. Uh, and then that's it for the YouTube. And Twitter's Twitter. It's right there. If you want to follow me on Twitter, sure, whatever, I guess. I don't, I don't fucking know. I can't. I can't tell you what to do. And that's it for me. So, as always, for those who came and watched the stream live, thank you very much. It's fun hanging out with you guys. I appreciate it a lot. If you're not followed, do it now. You get, you know, Twitch now has the free follower emotes, which I wanted forever. Right? So there's that. Um, And click the, if it has a notification thing for Twitch, do it. All that bullshit. Same thing with YouTube. For people watching this on YouTube, come watch it on Twitch first. You don't get to see it until the playthrough's done. And then, you know, click the notification if you like what you're watching on YouTube. Leave a like. It helps out with notoriety for the channel. So we get more eyes on the channel and stuff like that. And other than that, you know, same old, same old. Once again, thank you all for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Stay happy. Stay healthy. And take care.